give it how's our walkie talkie working everything good on the walkie talkie let me hear you on the walkie talkie son yeah. big dig winga dinga jinga do how about you no you're like a dr seuss book no picture yet It'll, 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 it, you gotta give it a little bit. Goddamn, it's a delight. Relax. Well. Welcome, welcome, welcome <laughs> to the bike day for you. Coming to you live. Who said that? For West oh, oh, Beach, Long Island, 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 New York. It said this content is inappropriate for children. <laughs> for a second, I thought it was talking the show. The thing right on here. It says inappropriate for children? Yeah, it came up on the screen. It's a commercial for the game that's playing. But it was timed so perfectly because it went dark. And then it popped up, no. and then I was like, uh-oh. I didn't pay, I, I, they should pay extra money, I think, for that. They should, no, I yeah. agree. <laughs> Welcome, guys. We're having some fun. We're back at you. All hail, son of a... Son of a is the magic man. Today's show is dedicated to the magical powers of son of a. Everybody bow down to son of a. You would not have the show today if it wasn't for son of a. Hit the button, mute button. You did? <laughs> so, bing. It's all about it. We got it figured out. It was a YouTube thing. It was a Wirecast thing. It took some coordination. It just got fixed within 15 minutes of going live today. We were thought we were going to have to go on to the personal. It just it was it was getting really complicated. And then all of a sudden, some of us says, "I got it! Yahoo!" So here we are today, coming to you live from West Hampton Beach, Long Island, New York, and it's a cloudy e, ugly e, not raining. Father's Day weekend, and all you fathers out there, happy Father's Day to you. Uh, come on over to the Bike Man for you for your free bracelet. I don't have one on. <laughs> if you would like a free bracelet, come on down, and you will get one. These bracelets uh, are made from 100% silk. <laughs> silk on whatever. Just be like, um, could be yours. Yeah. All right, so anyway, to make a long story short or a longer story longer, today's show is presented by Cali. Cali Protective, safety takes no holiday. Make sure you wear your helmet. Today's show is sponsored by Surface. Surface products, Surface tires, Surface pumps, Surface, Surface, and Mo Surface. I have to have an apology to my man, Mr. Forrest Thomas, out there in YouTube land. I can't remember where he's from, but he ordered a set of Surface tires. And I've been having a devil all the time getting them. I do believe they will be arriving on the facilities land on Monday. He got himself some uh, Drifter City 2.0, 26. Really? Those big fat boys. You're going to love them. Uh, DMX boy them. rode those tires for a while. I did. It's an awesome tire. Though. Surface makes great tires. If you're not familiar with them, you really should check them out. If you're getting plagued with flats or something like that, you know what? You might want to think about one of the Surface Survivor Series. They're an awesome tire. Check them out. Today's show is also sponsored by EVT, Efficient Velo Tool, and the magical 3-in-1 inflationary head sponsoring the EVT Air Station right here with this beautiful piece of equipment, a must-have for every pro shop. Now, we've kind of jerry-rigged this press the valve adapter because our string broke on here and uh bmx boy decided to do a little arts and crafts with some sort of springy thing here and i don't know if it's going to last but it seems to have it's going on like three days right now and we shall see what happens original thought was i was going to bend up a spoke all nice and tight so when you took it off it just kind of spun around and stayed but that was going to take way too much time, and you don't like when I. I don't like it when he starts. Well, now you know if we if we got other things like today, we're kind of like we're in such good shape. We are so we're caught so up. We're so caught up. It's not even funny. Uh, we've had crappy weather kind of this week, and yeah, it was kind of crappy last sad. weekend, and oh, uh, but we got everything figured out. And EVT also makes the Safe Zone Mirror, which has been flying out of here, by the way. To your door, 40 bucks for an EVT safe zone mirror. Come on over to the bikemanforyou.com and get yours today. All right, that covers the fun part of the show. What's the matter? You gotta hit the head? Yeah. So it's an exciting day. It was an exciting week. We were anticipating the arrival of the coaster pedicab. All week long, we were anticipating this, and it finally arrived on Thursday. As soon as it got here, 
we put it together. It came in this tremendous crate. Beep, 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 beep. It comes with its own backup. Beep, beep. Uh, the Coaster Petty Cab, American made. Has the canopy on it, which is removable. Extremely well made. I cannot tell you how easy it was to, everything just went together like a champ. It didn't take as too bad a timing. It is not electric. It does not pedal assist. It has none of that kind of stuff. This can be removed as well. It just has snaps, so you could do it without any kind of deal. It would make a nice logo. His color choice was, eh, all right, I guess. It's not black and orange, but I'll let him slide. Um, it runs really well. We changed up the seat a little bit to a little bit fatter seat. We also added a mirror here. It was quite the experience teaching this gentleman how to ride this thing, to say the least. Where are you? Oh, there you go. So, it was, uh, it was quite an experience. Freddie has a little bit of video of some things maybe we could figure out on, a, on a, a, uh, the guy, again, riding a trike. You got, you got to throw everything that you know about riding a bicycle out the window. And then you just ride the trike. It's very difficult to tune your brain after you've ridden a regular standard bicycle. Because now, when you go this way, you got to go this way. And then you go that way, you got to go this way. And it's totally opposite. But once you get the hang of it, it's not too bad. This is not pedal assist. We did not go for the motor option. The motor option was considerably more money. They do have a buffang motor that would go on it. I can't wait because I think it's just a matter of time before we go for it. <laughs> He's got about a two and a half mile journey. Now the guy who's bought this thing, hats off to this guy. I like this guy. He's very family oriented and he's taking care of his father. He's about 60. So you can imagine Daddy O is 20 years older or thereabouts. A very family oriented, and in what better way than to do this for this gentleman on Father's Day? This part also comes up and down. The father is going to be ridden in the pedicab to the synagogue. When you on the day of the Sabbath, you're not supposed to drive to the, you know, it depends upon how serious you're into that religion, into your religion, you know, like any other religion. So they're pretty serious about it, and, you know, they want to observe their deal, and they are not all supposed to drive or motorized or any of that kind of stuff to the synagogue on the day of the Sabbath. So this gentleman decided that he wants to uphold his values, his family values that his father brought to him, and he wants to pay it back to his father. So he purchased a pedicab, and he's going to shuttle his father back and forth to the synagogue. My heart's off. Hats off to you, Larry. I think you're an awesome guy. Um, taking care of your father like that and helping him with his wishes is to be commended. So that's the story behind it. Now, does a pedal assist have something? Does that, would that cons constitute... Um, a motor? I'm not sure. That's something I'm going to have to ask him, and we'll see what happens, if that happens. I think he's going to have a hell of a time riding this thing for the two and a half miles that he's going to have to ride it. We'll find out. Um, we had a little lesson prog program yesterday with him, and he rode promptly into the hedges, into the side, and then we finally got him. He wanted to continually keep putting his foot down as he started to crash, uh, which is deadly on the trike. <laughs> It'll run you over. <laughs> and uh, we finally got it handled. And he was able to go around the parking lot a couple of times both ways. We spent about an hour or so. And I'm feeling pretty proficient now. Let me just give you a couple of briefings on what's going on with the bike. It is all 100% made in America. It's out west in, uh, I don't know where, somewhere. Uh, Oregon, I think. 
Coaster Pedigree built in Montana. Excuse me. Serial number is right here. It does have a battery, a small battery system that's just inside of here. And it, we charge it accordingly. This is the power button here. And that is going to enable you to have a powered light on the front. It gives you running lights on the sides here and on the back over here. And you do have directional as well that you can do. And it has hydraulic brakes with a brake light. Check that out, right? The brake system on this is a hydraulic, it's almost like a motorcycle system, and it goes to the drivetrain, to the rear drivetrain, to the axle, so it's an axle brake. It's really powerful, it's really sturdy and substantial, if this thing got a little speed going down. It is equipped with 18, 8, 8 and 7 for a total of 24 speeds. We put on a new surface saddle on here so that he got a little extra tush protection. The saddle that it came on, it was a Cloud 9, kind of too skinny, but we went with a new Surface E-Gel Lycra -like cover. It does have two parking brakes as well. Uh, let's see how it runs. It's part of the crew now. It's not, we don't own it, but we're going to see it pretty regularly. The, oh, it has a little storage place underneath the seat. It's quite comfortable. It's quite nice. Uh, it's it's a, kind of fun. It's a lot of fun. You know, you could be in business at some place if you wanted to by purchasing one of these and then charging for rides, obviously. So, Freddie's thinking about it. He's going to get himself one. And he's going to go to the car meet. Oh, the, the other thing, it's got a little magnet right in here, so it kind of like automatically just kind of clicks right on. It's nice. It's nicely made. It was well thought out. Uh, I, I am, I'm impressed with it. Freddie's even impressed. Now, if Freddie's impressed with it. Yeah, it's, it's a really nice quality. It is quality. It's not like real Chinese junk. No, not even close. Freddie loves the fork on this yeah. thing. It's got the big fatty gauge spoke. I want to say these are 12 gauge spokes with an yeah, aluminum alloy like rim. Workman spokes. Um, but it's, you know, it, I think the, the, the bearing mechanism and whatnot, I feel, is better than Worksman. Yeah. But again, oh, it, this I'm thing sure ain't cheap. Is. This is no cheapy machine. Um, nice set of clip-on bars on here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it doesn't go that fast, Fred. No, you put it on a motorbike. Oh, okay, now I got you. So. It's got some kind of parking brake. It does, it doesn't no, it's, it'll roll. You're in between right now. There you go. Yeah, but it doesn't really do anything. The, par the parking brake is on the front on that one. This one has a parking brake as well. Oh, okay. the, the, but oh, when I hit the parking brake on this one, it automatically puts the light, puts the light on. on. Oh, so sweet. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna put that on, uh, for for it's just simple purposes. Nice um. It's a nice piece. It's a nice piece over there. Oh. That one right there. I'll hang this back up up here, okay? Oh. So that's the story of Petty Cab. If there's any questions, come on down or let's hear them. Let's let's go over to the videotape and see what the story is. Oh, we gotta put a water bottle cage on it. He would like to have a water bottle cage. So I picked up a couple of hose clamps because I really don't want to drill the frame, so I'm just going to put a couple of hose clamps right around the edge. I'm going to put that baby right in here. With a couple of, you know, standard old hose clamps. That'll work just dandy, and uh, it won't look super pretty, but you know what? It'll be all right. Uh, any questions at all, Frederick? Anything no. going on over here? No. I, no. I seem to have lost glasses if anybody sees my glasses these are my prescription prescription uh, sunglasses nothing how much for the basic well price? you're gonna have to go and look it up on your own guys I'm not yeah. gonna uh -oh. oh there you go yeah. Artie Mike has already got it checked out it does have a seat belt on it yes it is 
It's just a simple coaster petty cab. He looked it up. Yep. So, coaster petty cab. That's it. It's good. You'll be seeing it for. Uh, it'll be coming around pretty regularly on Saturday because Saturday is the day of the Sabbath of the Jewish religion. Oh, we got him hooked up with a tarp, too. All right, let me put that. Is that it for this? Does that look like it, Frederick? We got any other further questions? I could put this back into position and hold. some rentals set up and ready to go here today I was figuring that maybe we'll do some rental business because of the fact that uh, it's not really not a beach day and it's still really not quite the season yet but it's damn close to it um, we got another week or two here before the 4th of July but you know this week is kind of rounding up the home stretch baby G's got a couple tests this week and then that's it by the end of the week She's done with private school, so probably most of the other private schools in the area are going to be done, and some private schools are already done in the area. And the public school is going to be done uh, probably within this week, next week. And then all hell kind of breaks loose around here, kind of. Um, it's getting weirder and weirder. The sales environment, the retail environment is getting weirder and weirder. Um, definitely one of the most challenging seasons that we're dealing with this year not only from the retail environment and what's going on with retail, but also with the weather. Good morning, how are you? Good. Do you sell baskets here by any chance? Do I sell baskets? Oh boy. Boy, do we sell baskets. I have got enough baskets that's gonna blow your mind. And you would like to put it onto this bicycle right here. One that I can take off and, and put on. So like one that I can easily remove like after I go to market so it's not always on my bike. Is that possible? Yes and no. Okay. It depends upon how, how, you know, you are on what we call sport fitness. Uh -huh. My handlebars cannot come up any. I do not have a lot of distance between here and here. Okay. Which could hinder what kind of basket we put on there. Okay. But we're going to find out. Okay. Worst case scenario, we would put a rear rack on the back, and then you could do all kinds of things. And it can come off and go on? Well, once the rear rack goes on the bike, that would stay on, but saddle bag, a grocery bag, a farmer's market bag, a trunk type bag, that would come on and off of the rack. Let me see, because I want to see what a rack looks like. You are going straight through that back door, uh -huh. and you're going to go see Alexandra, uh -huh. and she is going to blow your mind. Okay. Can we check the air in this thing? Uh, I'm going to do that while you guys are inside. Uh, Just hit so your kickstand nice. down right there. Is my, is my bike okay for me? Is your bike okay like for you? He says the seat's wrong, but like my feet, my toes touch the ground. Like, I want to stop. Is the seat should be higher or low? Higher. No feet touching the ground? No feet touching I think mine's a little too low. Right? This is a little too low. Yeah. I don't want to scare you into where it should be or how it should be or any of the above. Maybe when I get a little if more you're out, on the road. Well, this is what I'm getting at. If you're doing it, lady, and you feel good, yeah. then that's good. All right. So then I'll is it proper? It like, Who gives a damn? This is like the first time I'm on truck highway. I, I'm a little scared. This is the so first, one of the first times on this down. brand new bike. Both these guys like are like that. brand spanking yeah, new. Off the block. Yeah. yeah, I hear you. So yeah. again, yes, but you know, down future. Okay, future. The way you are right now is the like way you would stop your bicycle. Now, when you push up, you would put this up into this position here. You're going to push down and then put your butt up onto the seat. Right. Mm -hmm. That way you get proper leg extension. You should not right, be able I to sit. I don't have proper leg extension. I can tell. Well, then you knew the answer before you even asked it. I knew. He was I right. He was right. You really just want... Wrong. I got to validate, guys. No, his... But his bike was wrong, then. Well, he does... It, the yeah, it doesn't... Hey, isn't he the kind of guy that... Hey, do as I say, not as I do. Yeah. You know? Yes. So so be it. You know? That's what us guys do. All right? When are you ladies going to start to, you know, deal to with that? I'm to Alexandra. She's a woman, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. She's a woman. All right. I'll go go right on in there. Go hang with uh, Yeah. All right. You go hang with her. And the men hang out here. It's segregated out here, you know? What's your first name? 
Sherry? Yeah. Sherry, nice to meet you. I'm Bart. Bart. Now, just out of curiosity, why? Why? Why what? No, they didn't, though. They're coming from Southampton. Yeah, they're out of Southampton. They're brand new. I know, but, well, whatever. Hose schmoes. It wasn't us. So now it's time to total. What is that thing? It's a. ATX, this is a fat tire. Oh, this is the Verve. The Verve 2 is what this is. This is a 700 by 45 C. It's a big fat tire. Um, it's kind of, what are they, they going to call that, that style? It's what, like city commuter, urban? Yeah. It's, like a, it's like a cross between a hybrid and like a sport fitness. Well, you know, you know it, they used to call it a comfort bike, but it was 26 was a comfort bike. 26 inch wheel was a now comfort. Remember those? Now it's going to this fatter 40s. Yeah. 740. I've seen them with uh, 50 C tires. The, so again, the industry is changing so yeah, rapidly in the different types of bikes. Here is a totally different type of bike. So there you have it. Ladies, how are you? Good, how are you? This is my niece, Xanthi, from Hong Kong. Nancy from Hong Kong? Xanthi. Xanthi. Z. X. S. Xanthi. X. X, An A Ancy. Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna screw that up. <laughs> so I'm sorry. She would like to rent a bike. Okay. And so would her brother, who's only a little bit taller. Okay. So I wanted to take away two kids' bikes. We'll bring one of them back. Uh, she's going to camp on um, Monday or Tuesday, and we'll keep the other one for another week or so. Okay. Does that work? Well, whatever you would like to do. And then the last time I came, I bought from you the. The blue bikes that you also use for renters with the white tires, remember? And we had that trouble because we didn't know about the valves. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So, so this um, is your pump. So you were going to show me to make sure I can work this, and if I can't work it, we'll buy another one. Okay, so let's take care of this old business first. And then I also need, because I only brought you one of the two bikes, so you were going to give me a... a Adapter. The adapter valve for the second bike. You don't need an adapter with this pump. Oh, good. Well, that. Well, okay. Maybe that's why I never had adapters. All right. So here we go. Place. Here we go. This is called the Presta valve, right? Yeah. One of your bikes probably has one of those, right? I do. And you got to unscrew that little petcock a little bit, right? Unscrew you see, the petcock. You see how that thing turns, right? Yeah. There it goes all the way locked, and then out. You can't take it off because it's you know, it just stops. Okay. Push it in. Oh. Now it's operational. You with me? Oh, Little hole. Okay. It's going to gazanta, and then we're going to oh, flick the gazanta up the like that. Yeah. Okay, here we go. What's a gazanta? I mean, I have it. The handle. <laughs> you don't know a You don't know Mr. Gazanta? <laughs> He's a cousin of Gazanta. It's going to need a tire. All right? Yeah. You're with me. Everybody's cool. Yeah. All the way up, all the way down. I'll get it. Yeah, Your pump is broken. It sucks. I know it sucks. Does, All right. right? I'm not wrong. You're not, You're not wrong. wrong. It is. You are vindicated. You are done. You are finished. Yeah, yeah. Pump has see seen better pump. days. Bye yeah. bye, pump. Okay, good. Buying a new pump. <laughs> no wonder we couldn't get it. <laughs> You'd be pumping a hell of a long time with that lady. All right. That's going in the garbage, right? Right. Good. All right. We'll worry about that later. Okay. I got so no air. I got no air in this root road bike. Okay. Here's the cap for it. All right, now, young lady. So you want to put the cap back on there? No, you've oh, got to get air in it. No yeah. Now, I think that this young lady is not a kid bike anymore. Oh, Seb? Because she's almost, she's, her legs are damn close to as long as your legs. So, you know, we tried her on those, though, and she felt like she was going to fall off. On what? The ones I would well, the white what, tire. Well, what if, well, on the white, all right. Well, I'm not worrying about the white tire. I'm talking about this one, because this is a rental. So that seat is down there pretty low right now. Now, now, I mean, it, it, she's flat-footed now. That's, that's no good. Too low. It, it, but this is what I'm getting at. How do you think? All right. Cool. It's too low, right? Oh, so wait a minute now. Do you know how to ride two wheels? Yes or no? I don't know how to ride a bike. You do or you don't? I do. Okay, good. It's just not, you 
Look, look that way. Okay. What do you mean it's not common? It's not common it's not in Hong Kong? No, I see all these no. pictures of these, whoops, sorry, these people in Hong Kong that are, you know, going crazy men and riding bicycles in the city streets where they're, they're so, yeah. All right, let's see. Okay, time out for half a second. I don't want to ride the bike. These shoes stink for love. No, no, no. We just, yes. Okay. So, what do you, so do you think we should maybe go across the street to try this? Or what, do you, what would you like to do, my dear? Whatever. just got interrupted. Well, she don't want to. And I, and I can understand. It's a little encumbering right here. You know what I mean? But I want to make sure that this thing works for her. Okay? So, I'm going to let you guys go. Go do whatever you want. You know how that seat works, right? Yes. raise. Because I think once she goes one, 10 feet, she's going to want that seat up a little. Okay. What rack options she has? Go, yes. go, go try we'll whatever. Put Come back and see me in a little bit. All right? Yeah. I forgot your favorite. Anne, okay. Anne. Okay. Auntie Annie. Auntie Anne. Yep. Marco, how much is this tire? I get it from Marco. It's hard to snack and eat any of the food I make at the market. How'd you do? Yep, Sherry, Sherry? Mark's getting a rack to show her. Well, I get Mark working on it. You have three of us working on it. So you need these two put together is bottom line, right? Right, for Sherry, Jeff's bike and Sherry's bike. Mark's getting a rack to see what rack will fit Sherry's bike, and then she's probably going to go with pannier, giant pannier. The basket's going to be too small for her. First, okay? Can you put the mirror on his bike first so I can see it? Sure. Okay. You want to see what it looks like? There's, oh, there is, there's one of them right on the pedicab right here. The weather was nicer, it would be better, but we'll take it. It's not round. No. Yeah. No, that's what we say. It's like we, we're ready to just... Nature, but Mia. Not much. Uh, you know what Greg was saying yesterday? Can't get much worse the weather this spring, can it? Or it's up. Greg was saying, what, 2000? I don't even know. 2008? Yeah. Like eight out of the. Uh, I remember that we are. Greg, keep quiet. Mm -hmm. Shit, how big to shut his mouth. Yeah, Don't put really breath. Is that is like the ten year cycle or something like that? Yeah, I mean, right. it, we get the hundred year storm about every five years nowadays, so <laughs> I, that makes sense. Yeah, it's quick, it's quick, it's quick hundred years, isn't it? Yeah, it's a fast it, yeah. She doesn't want a mirror on cars. I want it on. No problem. Not right now. What's that? I understand, Sherry. No mirror for her. All right. No mirror. Oh, you ride the car. You ride the car. You ride the car. Oh. Yeah, right. Wiggy's in the house. Wiggy's, Wiggy's going to say that hello to Win Winchester back there? No. So, so. <laughs> Hi, baby. You never knew it was so much fun at this bike shop, did you? No. You will. You'll before. never go to Southampton again, will you? No. All right, good. Come here, boy. Didn't know it was here. You didn't know we were here. We're only celebrating our 41st year. We moved into our. Only our 41st year. Only. You just moved into your house? Congratulations, yeah, guys. Congratulations. Blanket blends in. Okay. And you can carry other things on it, right? You can carry uh, rack top bags, panniers. Oh, I don't know everything. any of those things. You get the rat trap, that's a pannier, side pannier. A ton of bags. Bags for the side. Cool. What's that price mark? Okay. Uh, okay. We'll take the same for her brother or how old? How old is brother? About the same height as you? Um, Not much. Guy version of that bicycle. If you're carrying bricks, what do you yes. think? Is that like a plan? Yeah. Okay. okay. So, so we're good. Now, I just need. Like got, I would assume that brother would want to ask If you start you know. carrying no, like, like over. Okay. We do have a lock for brother, yeah. okay? Now, no, remember this, sir. okay? Oh, but if you're carrying, like, I want to write it down. It's really difficult, it's okay? <laughs> Two, zero, one, okay, so I'm seven. Top you good with that? What do you think it stands so for? You good? <laughs> you are quick. Yeah, you are quick. Yeah. They got that new yeah. math yeah. over there in Hong yeah. Kong, yeah. I see. Oh, great. Uh, <laughs> uh, all right, and this one, yes, you do. You get it whether you like it or not. Okay. And nice same we thing. Wouldn't be together. Well, still, just to be on the same side. Okay. 2017 for um, you as well. The thing to share about this bag. Right. Let's do this. When you're not using it, you can How do you do it? You would maybe put it around like the wheel, like this, and then around something solid, like a. 
poster of something. You with me? What if someone hijacks it? What if somebody hijacks it? Ooh, that could be a problem. I guess we're just going to have to write it out to Auntie, Auntie, Auntie Ann's credit card is the bottom line. All right, Auntie Ann, come on in here. Now we're going to start to do the fun stuff. No problem. Okay. So should I take one of the adapters just to take a little time? It's going to take Yeah, you could do that. You could. Let's continue taking care of where we're at, all right? All right, here we go. Auntie Ann, come over here to my office. We're good with dogs. You're all right with dogs? Good. All right, so multiple day, multiple day is $40, $45 a day. How okay. many days are you looking to do? Um, well, I'd like a week, to. If you wanted to do one for a whole week, you're looking at 230 bucks. So she's leaving either Monday or Tuesday, so we will bring one back then. Where are they here? Phone number just so maybe. Okay, so we're going to do. Well, yeah. Maybe you can just take a deposit and we'll do it properly in well, the end. But, well, but I want to kind of try to get something going here today. Sure. So she is Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Let's do four days. Four days. For both bikes. Okay, four days, both bikes. And then when I come back. Then if, we'll settle accordingly. If I bring one or two, we can take it. Two from bikes. There. I got two locks. Oh, right? Yep. I got two helmets. Oh, no, I have right. helmets. <laughs> uh, it's coming with it. Oh, yeah, sure. It's got to. My it's rental included. bike's got to go. Yeah, it comes, okay. with, comes with the program. No, but I've bought many for me. Well, so that's have cool. Them. I'm glad you got helmets, but you're getting <laughs> two additional ones with a, with a rental bike. So okay. that there's no excuses okay. that you don't wear a helmet. Got it. Uh, two bikes, two locks, two helmets. I got one basket. Now we're going for four days. Now, why do Both we them, want right? the basket? Your basket's already on it. It's staying there. <laughs> Okay. okay. Whether you like it or not, it's coming. I asked already once, do you want a basket for his? You said no. no. I said no problem. Yeah. All right. So I'm going for four days, correct? Correct. All right. So I got four times 45 times two, correct? You write that up for me. You with me, I'm Allie? I'm with you. I'm looking at four days, and you can handle, you can, and if you could take care of all of the rest with me, take care of all the rest of it. All right, Al? Yes. Thank you. Right. You guys are set. Yep, we're going to get, let's take care of that first. Let's get all of that taken care of, and then we'll go to, she can help you out with a pump. Okay. Why, where's my coffee? There we go. How about you? Bring it on home. It's all about the look, baby. Bring it on home. Every question was. Got to be, how does it look? How does it look? How does it look? And my seat height, okay? That's the kick. You know you're in trouble when they ask you that. <laughs> Tweak this a little. Yes, sir. Yeah, you know you're in trouble when they ask, "Is my seat?" Look more than anything. Well, it's that you know, it's a loaded question. They know the answer. <laughs> they, they know the answer. They know the answer. They don't want to hear the right answer. Right. And then when you do, then they try to vet, you know vindicate what you've said. You know, uh, it's okay. I uh, I've been there. You know, I've been doing this way too damn long. That's a problem, right? You got a good knife for me there, Marco? You need a good knife. Oh yeah, baby. What's your first name? Harvey. Harvey, nice to meet you, Park. I think it's going to be like this all day, just what you see. They said it might clear up a little bit, but I don't think so. You don't have any blades? Oh, you're killing me. That's all right. I sold Harvey a new tire. That a boy. Harvey needed a new tire. That thing, yeah, that, I, saw, I saw it from a mile away yeah, before. I didn't see it. <laughs> I'm not looking at you like, what are you doing? Nah, no, that's, that's all right. That's what they all went back like they do. Yeah, the, yeah. Are you yeah. sure? Now, you don't want it together, so you're, you're going to put it. Yeah, yeah, because i got to slide yeah, it. Let's get a little lube on that chain. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to grease it up. Double check that thing. Mm -hmm. See Harvey, all right. He looks like a good guy. Yeah, I mean, you know, on a, on a, how on a Father's Day. Day. How to, how to, on a Father's Day. You got anything good and planned for tomorrow or what? Yeah, I got it. All right. That ain't bad. That ain't all bad. Barbecues are always fun. Especially bad enough to cook. All right, you going to have somebody else? Absolutely. Thanks. All 
I am still, so that everybody knows, I'm still looking for my glasses, all right? Keep on your, I, I, I'm going to continue to say that until I find my, my, my regular glasses. Sucks getting old, Harvey. Gotta have No, those aren't the ones I'm looking for, because they're, yeah, they're sunglasses. I would try to be positive, Harvey. I would try it, you know? I got up this morning and I said, I'm going to be positive. So far, it ain't working too good. Not yet. It's about as close to raining as it can get right now. And not rain. Harvey's done. Harvey's done. We gotta write Harvey up. Oh, so Harvey, we're streaming live right now around the world. Did you know that? Well, I saw the YouTube stuff. Yeah, we got thousands of people watching us from around the world right this second. Can you believe that? I believe it because I shouldn't say it. <laughs> <laughs> well, a lot of time in the house, let's put it that way. You think that's what it is, or do you think it's just entertainment? Hey, Mark, do you want to talk? You know, I mean, you know, the... Uh, reality uh, uh, TV uh, shows uh, out there. Yeah, well, it does, you know, it's all okay. I mean, you know, you're a reality. You are now on YouTube broadcasting around the world. We have thousands of people watching us right this second. It's crazy. Do they have too much time on their hands? Some. <laughs> so, are they clicking on the ads on the Google? Yeah. I hope. I hope. I hope. Yeah. yeah. What do, All right. call, what do you call this one again? Presta. Presta, okay. Because you gave me an adapter on one, on the adapter there is a regular right. cap. Right. It doesn't. Okay, so stay show. Firm. So I'd like to go back to the Presta cap. Okay, give her a Presta cap. Right here. <laughs> That's easy. Now that I have the pump that works. No, I'm with you. you. And then I'll keep, what do I do? Just keep one adapter in case I know I'm going to a gas station? I guess. That's I like to keep it on the valve. I, 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 you know, I, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna deviate from my original plan. And well, then would you have a better cap? Because it twists right off. Okay, let me get you another regular cap. Okay, then I need two regular caps Here, and two regular. Presta. Give her two regular caps. Two. How many? You want to have a dozen of each, two and you want to go in business on the side? Or what? <laughs> two regular caps, two Presta caps, and a bagel and cream cheese, please. <laughs> Two There's two Prestas, and here comes two regulars, right? Yes. And then Would you like a green regular? One adapter. And one adapter. <laughs> we'll go inside for an adapter. Well, maybe not. So is this there you go. All right. Now, what? We're loading these things up, yeah? yeah that would be excellent. We're just you free Oh, no, you're not. I'm, I'm with it. I got it. I got it. I'm happy. Somebody's writing up Harvey? Yeah. Somebody's got to write up Harvey. Oh. Yeah, I'll be right with Harvey. Right with Harvey. Please. Oh, neither one of these cars look big enough to put anything in. Oh, boy. I'm with you. I don't know which one I'm going in. That's what. That's what my. You think? How far are you guys going? All right. Da, 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 da. What do you mean? Absolutely, ride the bike on the pavement, not on the side. You shouldn't be walking on the sidewalk. 
riding on the sidewalk. The sidewalk, that's this part, the, the cement part. You should be riding in the road. But your traffic in Quag is not too bad. Oh boy, you know, these fancy cars, nobody knows how to so work annoying. them. We do this every time. Wait a minute. There we go. Oh, you got that one done. All right. That's cool. Pull the le le lever. Pull the lever. That. Oh my God, you are so smart. She, uh, that's why we got her. <laughs> All right, here we go. Somebody stay in there. Somebody stay in there. I'm going to feed you the bike. All right, now pull that in, keep it, keep it. Put that tilt if you can. Tilt the handlebar, the the whole steering wheel up to. The, yeah, that's it. Yeah, I want her. My team. She's got the idea. She's the smartest out of everybody today. <laughs> we have some pretty intelligent people come by on occasion. All right, now. There we go. There we go. Oh yeah. You now you have to put that pedal through the because it's not gonna. Yeah. Can if you, you can tilt this. Pedal. Don't move. Stop. Everything. Great. Thank Stand you very clear. much. Good luck. We will see you on Tuesday. Tuesday. Oh boy. Rentals, I had the right idea. You did? Totally. Did somebody write up Harvey? Harvey's being written down. All right, good. I'm gonna take care of that. We, gotta get, we made some lunch. We got lunch money today at least. Thank goodness. That looks nice. It looks very good. Very, it's all about the look. Oh boy. Oh, that is some good coffee, especially when it gets a little chilly. Mm. It's like a mocha. All right, so. Where was I? Where was I in my last latest rant? Uh, yeah, I, was, I was beating on somebody. Baby G. That was a good rental, huh? What do you mean you guess? Four days, 45? No, it was only three days. Mom said it was only three days. Oh. It was today, Sunday. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and they're coming back on... Oh, okay. All right, so three days. Three days times two. That's a good rental. I like that. I like renting bikes. Um, all right. So, where was I on my latest rant? Nobody remembers. Amazon and Whole Foods? Amazon and Whole Foods? Amazon, that's what it was. Thank you. I guess so. so, the mighty Amazon monster has struck again as of last, yesterday. They decided that they were going to buy Whole Paycheck. I mean, Whole Foods. Whole Foods is a... food store that sells organic, they pride themselves on natural, organic, and just GMO free, and, and you know, it's it, it caters to that, there's a couple of them, in, there's quite a few of them in the city, and, and it is a little hipster, but it's, you know, Whole Foods, but it's pretty popular. So Amazon decided that they were going to pay $13 billion for Whole Foods. Good morning. How are you? It's stupendous. We have a, a broken tube. A broken, a flat tire. A flat tire. <laughs> the tube is broken. A we weekend warrior flat tire to boot. There you go. I hate it when that happens. Yeah, this one's just a little. Flat. We're gonna we're gonna get a little air in the front in that it's here. We're gonna put a new tube in there. You're gonna be looking at nine dollars for the tube. Okay. And we also get twenty bucks to put it in. So you're looking at a grand total of 29 bucks. Okay. You're going to leave it with me for a little bit. Okay. And then you have a helmet for him inside? Absolutely. 
Okay, great. What's your first name? Matt. All right, Matt. We're going to see what we can do about banging you out right away while you're inside, and maybe we can get this done while you wait. We're okay, not too really busy. Great. That would be sweet, wouldn't it? Be that way we get you going again. Thank right? You. What's your name? Olivia. Olivia? I like that. I like that name. All right, guys. Yeah, you can go right inside. Alexander's inside or Tony Joe. Thank you. Yep. Oh, Alexander is not inside. Alexander's still there. So, Amazon decided to buy Whole Foods. What's the big deal with that? What's the big deal with it? The big deal is that Amazon is slowly taking over the world. So who cares? Well, I kind of agree with you. Who cares? I think it is kind of exciting. The only thing is, is that Amazon is starting to hurt every retail business in America, which is okay. So be it, you know, including us. The reason that it's also so big is that Amazon has not really been going into that food business. The thing I don't like about Amazon is that when I ordered a pair of jeans off there, and it didn't look like the picture. The prank break. The jeans did not look like the picture. The, a couple pictures, they were like ripped in the front, and then the back, they were just like normal jeans on the back. And then I got them in, and they were totally different. Huh. And they spit small and it didn't work. I just throw them out. Y you didn't like it? You wasted your money on Amazon. Yeah. Okay. Cool. What did I buy from Amazon? Oh, remember when I bought the heater and it was here in like a day and a half? Yeah. yeah okay. And then I never used it. It's in the box. The <laughs> <laughs> bicycle retailer, I quote this magazine pretty regularly. If you're familiar with us, you know that I come to this. I read this magazine cover to cover every single month. And sometimes it's good stuff, sometimes it's malarkey, sometimes it's propaganda. Uh, but on the whole, it's the best cycling industry news magazine out there. And it's probably the only one I read. I do not read bicycling magazine. I do not read mountain biking magazine. I don't ride these consumer magazines because they are tainted. They are tainted via advertising dollars. And I can understand it. I mean, I'm, I, if I was taking $50,000 for a page ad or more, uh, I would definitely not rip that person's Trek, Specialized, Giant, Cannondale, any of them, their bike apart in any review that went into that magazine, period. It sounds like it's not fair, it sounds like it, but whatever, that is the rule, so consequently, I perform my own opinion on bicycles when they come we'll in. We'll say, exactly. <laughs> we we so, show no prejudice towards that. So, on to the magazine. Oh, I think the, you think? Oh, yeah. It went kaboom. Direct, selling direct online in the age of Amazon. I'm just going to read the beginning part of this thing, okay? If you believe the news you read, then you know that online commerce war is over and Amazon has won. Consider these stats alone. Over 60% of the growth of online retail sales came in 2016 through Amazon. 60% of the growth went to Amazon. Growth for the top 500 online retailers other than Amazon. The top 500 companies that sell stuff. I'm not just talking bike stuff, I'm talking stuff. Online went down. Their bottom line on online sales went down almost 12%. Amazon's sales growth for the same time frame went up 31%. Is the picture starting to get painted? I shall now go on. Amazon now represents 40% of all retail online sales in the United States. Whoa. Some 52% of U.S. consumers have an Amazon Prime account. 
just to be an Amazon Prime, I think it's, what is it, 100 bucks a year or something like that that you pay to be an Amazon Prime? It's a subscription service. But you get, like, movies and stuff. So just the revenue alone for Amazon by just becoming 52% of the consumers in the United States have an Amazon Prime account. Not me. Not me. I don't have one either. Adding fuel to the fire, in the first three months of 2017, retail store chains have shuttered more than all of 2016 in a record year. How you doing? Hello there. Stupendous. Um, we need a bike for guests that may stay at our house on occasion. How many guests? Well, we usually they come in two. Last week we had two, so we need a fourth for people come in pairs. So you, yeah, I know. You have a house in the Hamptons, That's they right. come in pairs. I don't right. understand so that. So you, know, you know, we bought we bought from you last week the Flourish. Okay. Uh, maybe maybe another one of those. Okay. We have two boy girls, two boy bikes, two girl bikes. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Hello. Uh, medium size frame. Unless you have something else that might be interesting. Well, the step through style frame <laughs> is universal for you know a guy. You would be struggling a little bit because of your height on a medium size with the seat up, but it could be done, is what I'm getting at. Whereas a female is not going to be able to necessarily ride a guy's bike that would be. Right, so we have two of those specialized giants. We had it in here, we were changing the tire on it okay. a couple of times, so which are sort of like a guy frame. Okay, so you have two specialized bicycles, right. one they're in working. One medium, one in a large. Okay, so you're good ride. with that. And then, and then you got one of these, medium. Oh, you got a flourish medium. So maybe we should go to a flourish small. You think? My this, this, hap this is a medium here, this is an extra small. This is a model of, uh, we're going to have to go over there, I guess. I, I probably got a small one. I would put her on a small yeah. problem. Most, most, most of the, I mean, most of the time, women love to be able to touch the ground and sit on the seat. So that's why I, I kind of, I, I hit towards that small. If I was, if you were just coming in here, hey, I need bikes for guests. I don't care, Bart, Camel. I would give you a medium men's and a small ladies. Done. Right. I need a pair of bikes. I need a pair of bikes for guests. We, ha you know, you guys aren't alone, man. We do this all the time. Right. <laughs> you know, we everybody. Has get a large, two mediums, and now we'll get it. I, I think that's the natural progression for you. Ladies, what are the color choices? What I don't. That that's a good question, my dear. Let's go. I don't have any smalls right there, so let's go over here. You taking care of my buddy over here? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you see proper height, you should not be able to touch the seat at all. I touch the ground with the seat. On, when you sit on the seat, you should have you know, just enough bend at the bottom of the stroke. If you're sitting and try to touch the floor, you should not be able to, if the seat is the right height. But most women don't like it at the right height anyway. Right. I hate to sound male chauvinistic, but it's the truth. riding the medium with the sheet all the way down. So far down that we even pulled the mirror off. Pulled the reflector off? The reflector okay. off. Okay. To get so, that would definitely say a small. The only color I have in small right now... Oh, I do have it in common. I have the omelet and I have red in the small. I can come back. Exactly. Want to see what you have and how much they right. exactly. Yep. Yeah, it comes with the sheet and the leather. No blue in that bike. No, I don't have a blue in the small. Only in the extra small, the blue. I two thousand seven 2018s, which are supposed to be out in six to eight weeks. This red's cool? Yeah, the almond to me looks a little pink. So I hear you. I hear you. I'm with you. Uh-oh. I got a hold Nicole on this. I might be able to put this on a different one. Hang on. Let's see. I, yeah. Yeah, what? Yeah, I need to hold it? Red's I got another done, one right? in. I'm going to take the ticket off. Red's done for the year. That right? one. Right. Yep. Yeah, this is it for the year. That worked yeah, out. That worked out for me. Tony Joe, could you help me out? With these guys here, if we could write no, these guys up. No, you don't have any blues even that have to be made. What are they getting by? I don't. I don't. No more blues. Period for the year. Okay. No more Done. Blues for the year.
No more reds for the year. The new ones are coming. Now it's only almonds, what they got left. If you could do me a big favor and write me up for these guys. Right. Yeah, I have. I'm gonna put this one on the small that's inside. I just said that. I have. It lucked out. Everything was good. Like, now this only has a kickstand on it, Tony. It does not have a water bottle cage. Do you want a water bottle cage? There's an additional nine bucks, ten bucks. Okay, you. We're gonna get one of those on there. Okay, so a kickstand water bottle cage plus that. Okay. I'm gonna put this back on here for Nicole. That is a small right there. Yes. How'd you guys make out? All right, inside. Yeah, we're all set. Thank you so much. Cool. You took care of all the paperwork, everything, the flat included, everything. Yeah, everything You're too done. damn good, man. Thank you. Thank you. You get a you get a double. All right, I got one more red after that. Let's say we got all pink. All right, water bottle cage. Here we go. I got no water bottle cages. All right, perfect. Olivia, this is it. You're back in business. I think let's just wait till we get done. Thank you very much. I You're really welcome, appreciate guys. it. Um, Have a great day, guys. You too. Don't let the dogs out. Thank you. What's that going to Amazon to go purchase some tires? I guess so. Possibly. You know what? What was it, what was he looking for? He wanted to take his knobby tires off and put on a very road style, and I showed him. On what kind of bike? A mountain bike. Oh. And I showed him, and then at, at first he didn't know what size his wheel is, and I was is it a 29er? <laughs> there's no way my frame is a 29er. And then I said, no, 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 tire size. He didn't know. So he had no clue. And then I started telling him pricing, and then he got the black, I think Mark has him up at the black flicker bell to the bike. Onto this red one? Yep. You got a right. black flicker bell. You got black flicker bells? Yeah. I, I'm getting the water bottle cages to put on. D D D Lee D D You got it. Can we put uh, just make a post-it note maybe? And, Cause I probably won't remember. Yeah, we got you. I'm with you. Got it all handled. Wiggy, you gotta stay in. Wiggy, you can't come out. D, 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 D. Those are dogs, those are footballs. D, 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 D. That's mean, mean Bart. That's mean. The AACP is going to start calling you because you're mean to dogs. Oh, isn't that special? Yeah. Yes, it'd be perfect right underneath my foot. noise when they're going through the air. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. All right.
right. We got ourselves a flicker bell. We got ourselves a a a, 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 a drinking apparatus. We are good to go. We are ready for the season. It's on this bicycle. It's got to go on the handlebar. It can't go on the bottom too. Uh, I think it's an OSHA thing more than anything else because if I start to put something here now I'm starting to turn it into a man's bike almost and then you know okay. it used to have them there and it made a lot of sense to You're me but yep. I'm not quite there yet yeah, hang on thank you very much thank you we're good with the uh, tire right? you're good with everything <laughs> you know it could be worse I tell you, it could be worse. All right, guys, you're set. Enjoy, have fun. No, no, no. We live right around the corner. We're gonna walk home. Cool. Hey guys, have fun. Take care. Nice to see you. Have fun. All right, guys. What? When I wasn't so busy? Oh. Thanks for nothing. We said we could wait. We could wait till next week, but who knows? It'll be sunny and yeah, and we'll be a double line. Yeah, you might not have been able to get that red. You know, no better time than the present. See you guys. All right. Thanks. Thank you. Have a great day. Oh, I was. That's a comfort. That's a considered a comfort bike. Twenty-six inch fatter tire, specialized. Got a suspension in it, very upright. Oh, okay. Right? Yeah. That was an easy sale. And twin forks. Really? Well, oh. brand, that bike was brand new too. I didn't even look at that. Well, I'm looking at everybody, you know, I'm trying to figure I it tried out. To. I'm trying I to figure it know. out. I just don't know why. You know, the idea we were talking about business and online and how to how to make your business better or whatever, brick and mortar and whatnot. You have to be fun. You, it's no longer that you can sell stuff, sell it at a good price, have the selection, hold your hand, do all of those things. It's not just that you have to do that, but in addition to all of that in this atmosphere, you have to be fun and have to have events at your place. And you have to be like, yay! And it is fun coming to the bike shop, to our bike shop anyway. Some bike shops are like, mm, what do you want? Mm, oh, you don't know what a 10-speed bike is? What's the matter with you? Mm, you know, a lot of customers and shops are like that. Um, we, on the other hand, we embrace everybody. Come on down. <sighs> so that's what we're dealing with. We didn't know you were here. Didn't know we were here. Well, what, what am I doing wrong that you didn't know I was here? After 41 years. That's what I want to know. We just bought a house here. You didn't know we were here. I don't know the answers, guys. I don't know the answers, nor do I try to figure them. I'm trying to figure them out. I would love to know them, but whatever. <sighs> okay. Stop thinking that you can compete. This is one towards the end of it, okay? What can you do to re long term market strategy for the, at for the atmosphere that we're in? Start thinking about protecting your distribution channels by not selling direct. I don't understand that. Oh, this is what the manufacturers, they're telling the manufacturers to do. Start working with your channel partners to create unique augmented retail experience that give your brick and mortar partners a reason to come stop thinking that you compete with amazon you won't be able to create infinite choices and lower price or faster delivery stop don't even think you can don't try to compete start developing customer service experiences that amazon can't deliver it's not too late to build a successful direct online strategy, but to succeed, you're going to have to set aside ideas that may have worked in the past. Ain't that the truth? It's tough out there, boys and girls. I don't care if you're selling bicycles or toilet paper. It is tough. But I'll tell you what, the coffee sales are in good shape at the 7-Eleven. Mm. Right. Absolutely. 
a lot of shops are doing that. They're starting a little coffee shop on the side. So that way they get a little espresso and a little... This is what shops are doing to try to make ends meet. It's tough. Oyster bar. <laughs> Shuck them and eat them, baby. Right, you know it. Suck them, baby, Um, so that's kind of what the story is. So, what do they got to say over there? Anything good? Nothing exciting. Any questions? Any questions for co questions or comments from anybody? Any kind of answers that we can answer? We only have one miracle mirror left, boys and girls. Jenny Brown, thank you for the awesome fires for this quiz. You're welcome, Jenny. All right, I'm going to get baby G on repairs. I'm going to hit the head real quick. Mute me down there for a second. <laughs> so what's, what's going on? Son of a is in the house. There he is, folks. The man. Look at him. Oh, look at him. He's got a little glow around him right now. It's like he's like this. He's like this. Like what? Are they, what? The, who was the guy that? You know, the Dalai Lama. That's it. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. The Dalai Lama. Yeah. You know, he's got that little glow, or Buddha, or somebody like that. Yeah. You know. All right, so there you have it, son of a great job. Did we finally figure out exactly what the hell the problem was, or what? 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 Either YouTube fixed it, or when I went to go re-authenticate our secondary YouTube channel to let us enable live streaming. And once I did that, I went back and on our normal channel, everything was good. good. Sweet man, miraculous, genius. Thank you, thank you, and it double thank you. On a, mostly luck. Well, you know what? Don't tell anybody 50 that. 50% luck, 50% skill. Don't tell anybody that. It was all skill. <laughs> you wouldn't, you know, hey. All right. Good job. Back at you. We got Wiggy in the house. Wiggy's in the house. Hey, Wiggs. What's going on with you, Wiggy? Are you a good boy? Come here. Did you say hello to everybody up there in YouTube land? Are you lickens? Huh? You're a good boy. Yeah. All right. All right. Right, you're done. See you later. All right, that covers that. Baby G. Baby G worked this morning. Started at 7. Humping vegetables. And then she got done at 9. And then came to here. I saw her this morning. You saw her actually doing her vegetable thing? I waved. And she was doing dragging it. stuff. She I didn't. You were bagging what? I came Shrimps? riding past and I looked at the and What kind of garden right store is that? How are you? I am good. I'm ready for my bike. I'm ready for you. I think Fine I need time. to I need to just buy a helmet because I didn't come with one. You need yeah. another helmet. No problem inside. at all. Go right inside and I'm going to find your bike. I'm not sure where it is, but where, let me pull it up. Do you know the name? It's a new one. It's a new one with a bunch Dallas of accessories on. Yes. <laughs> Down here, eh? Oh, the weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. And since we got no place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Oh, look at this beauty. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That is a bike of bikes right there. 
Nanox or no na no news. No nano no no news, it's good good news. No, uh other than I didn't think you saw. Did you see? They're you know <laughs> obviously our fans are awesome, as everybody already knows. I mean our show wouldn't be half as good if it wasn't for all of you guys. So one of the fans came up to me, hit me up on Twitter. Of course, if you're not familiar with us, we have a Twitter and Instagram and a Facebook. And gave me an article from the Icelandic Daily. No. Okay? Four guys found in a ditch. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> no. Puddled together. No. Close. <laughs> Close. They, now, again, I don't think it's our Nanooks, and I hope it isn't, but boy, it sure did sound like it could have been them. Why? There's supposedly, you know, the Ring Road, they call it, right? And I guess this is quite the thing that people go and they tour the Ring Road, whether it be by car or bicycle or hiking or whatever. And it's a whole road, road that goes all the way around Iceland. Right. Period. And obviously there's campgrounds on the Ring Road and there's this and there's other different things because the Ring Road is probably a pretty busy thoroughfare, I would imagine. Okay. So apparently there's a campground close by, there's a preschool close by, and then there's a park in between the preschool and the campground. You would. And apparently they were relieving themselves in the bushes ah, next to... Ah, nice the preschool okay so now they got busted for indecent exposure because they didn't go to the campground because they were too cheap to spend the money at the campground so they decided to public to, to park to camp right in the public park which is illegal in Atlantic rules or whatever whatever and then they were taking a going to the bathroom in the bushes and I guess they got caught and I, I and this is and it was a topic and if you want to read the whole article come over to the bike man for you Twitter and scroll down I retweeted it uh, and it's there oh I didn't really get into that detail and it did not say any names and it didn't say that it was Americans uh, but it did say that there were youths <laughs> <laughs> okay you know now let's not jump to conclusions, okay? Let's not. Uh, let's you know, but it sure I. It sure does sound. So now they're changing. Sure does sound like an improv. It seems like. I've been working, <laughs> a digging, a working. Woo! Over there with Icelandic criminals. Oh God. So. So yeah. So, I don't know, I ex they were supposed to be gone for three weeks, so today is three weeks. This is three weeks. This is three weeks. They should be home. They should be coming by. They should be... What? They gotta do their three Telling weeks. You, man. He's gonna take a dump. Three weeks on the road gag. Is he pooping over there? Over here? Yeah, this is where he pooped. That is not my job. Oh yeah, he just let down a nice... Oh, buddy, you're alright. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, doo -doo boy, doo -doo man. You are doo, doo man. That's all right though. At least they didn't do it inside the shop. Doo -doo man. You know doo -doo man. Can I try to this thing? No, because. Can I yeah. Yes. I never got to try it. I didn't either. <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna need a, I need a serial number off of this bike. I should buy one of these things and do it downstairs. Do it down, downtown. How much would you charge? They're not cheap though, Al. You're gonna take a long time to recover your money back. I charge 20 bucks, 10 bucks a minute. 10 bucks a minute? That's a bit much, don't you what? think? Come here. That's a bit, uh, Go ahead. It's 5 bucks a minute. I got, uh, K37. Come on, fly. Can you call fly, Dad? 039. 
It's gone, man. Five, come! Two, three, two. Laundry? What is that thing? A rove? R O R O V E. Yep. And it's a rove three? A rove three? Yeah, yeah, it's standard rove. Ready to rock and roll. Yeah, man. Yeah, baby. You are styling. All right, so what did we do? We got a rear rack on the back that okay. you can do whatever the heck right, you wanted to I do. I can just That's like, put something in for now, and then I'll figure it out. We got a kickstand. Right. We got a cage. Right. We got a mirror. Awesome. <laughs> we have a seat quick release. Yep, you got everything for me. And we have a pickup on Friday, but today is Saturday, so I'm good. Because it was pouring. I, yeah, whatever yeah, happened what yesterday. Oh, that's yeah, here. Bike, yeah, so I Tone. I didn't even think about that, actually, as I was doing Perfect. it, but I mean. It, it doesn't get much better, kid. Right? Kids off your helmet. You want to write me up for this? For it now? Yeah. I forgot. I, did I you pay for the helmet? I did the helmet because that's I what I was. That's what I was. Hair. That's what I was waiting towards. I'm gonna just give yeah. it to her. I got the bike at 455 and all of the items accordingly. Okay. Here's the serial number. Here's the road three. Here's her credit okay. card. And are these the regular air things? Regular uh, air things. Yeah, yes, okay. it's sh commonly referred to as a Schrader valve. Yeah, whatever. Well, uh, so you know, on that way, you know. I think I'm remembering that. Well, I'm hoping you do. I know it's a smooth ride. Wow. But now, it's not in the same position that it uh, was. Am I done yet? I, I know, but you're going to have a hell of a time trying to turn it around right here. You turn it around back there and back it in here. Please. And thank you. Are you selling this thing for people to... No, it's around? sold. Uh, it's yeah. sold. It's done. It got special ordered. It's really cool, isn't it? For a family or something? No, it's for a, a, a father bought it for his to be able to get his father to the synagogue Interesting. without, you know, continuing to observe his beliefs Good. and not taking a motor to the gog. No, it does not. What's the thing in the it's, a, it's got a, a battery in it for lights, uh, brake lights and instructions. Yeah. Lights, turn cool. signal, yeah. safety, yeah. Sta yeah. safety yeah. stop. Yeah, really cool. All right, you can head right inside. Tony's going right. That Tony's got that all going. You good here? You don't know what's going on. Okay. How you doing? Good. How are you? Not bad at all. A little overheated, but I'm okay. Well, it's a great riding day because there's no wind <laughs> and no sun, so you That's stay good. a little cooler, yeah. right? I'd say the bottom bracket is tight. What gives it away? Oh, well, it's derail it, derail it, derail or pulley too is not too good. Yeah, derail, no. One of these derail or pulleys is not good. I can tell that by the fact when you try to backpedal it. Yeah. You see how, see how it's hanging yeah, up yeah. right there at the bottom. And I can feel it in the bottom bracket seized up from salt water. Which you can see the salt water intrusion right here. And as well as on the chain ring. So that could be partly the reason why he feels a rubbing per se. Yeah. The other side of the coin is that he doesn't have enough air in the tires. Okay. Not even close. To fix this thing properly, mm -hmm. how old is the bike? Well, I'd say five years. You haven't put any money into it at all? Or? A little bit. I put, you know, you know I, ra I put a okay. razor in. You put in. an extension. Yeah, because I was yeah, leaning that, over. Right. I put smaller tires on after a couple of years. Okay. And I realized okay. I couldn't get any speed on the bike. Okay. So the only investment I made is the tire and the... And the extender, really. And you got some mileage on there. Oh, yeah, yeah. It sure could use a new chain, uh -huh. a new cog. Right. We should try to see if we can unfree one of these derail pulleys and whatnot, and probably a new bottom bracket, which is the guts that goes inside it. Uh-huh, okay. You're going to be, by the time it's all said and done, uh, between parts and labor and everything, you're looking about 100 and, 110 bucks for the, for the tune that's going to cover all our labor charges, and it's going to include a chain. Mm -hmm. Then you're looking at this is going to be about a $40-ish bill, mm -hmm. and then that's about a $40-ish bill. So what am I up to? Almost 200 Yeah. Is that to stay open like anything else the matter with it? The salt right water, yeah, you ride to ride Dune Road a lot, right? Yeah, uh, that's almost all my riding is. Yeah. Yeah. Dune Road is deadly on bikes. Yeah, I know. I know that. I mean, you can tell it's all. I can see it's, you know, it's a little rusted out. Some, of the, the some of the things that you could do to help it out mm -hmm. is rinse it off as soon as you get home. Oh, okay. Not necessarily put more lube on the chain. Right. More lube on the chain is... Mm. Mm -hmm. That's why we're replacing it, because there's a lot of gook and grime on this uh -huh. chain. Just to take a quickie look, mm -hmm. see where my fingers are right now? Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, see what's going on. I'll get a shirt now. Thank you, yeah. Yeah. All of that's embedded in, you know. Yeah, I hear it. Right. It acts like liquid sandpaper over uh -huh. a period of time, you know. And just beats the crap out of the chain, the cog, the right. crank. I would not replace the crank yet. Uh -huh. You know? It starts to get to the point like, you know, do I want to put the money into a bike or do I want to want to think about another bike? I don't know, you know, it's six and one half a dozen of another, you know? I mean, this bike costs you what? Four fifty, a little under five. Probably stock. About five, probably about five hundred bucks. If stock. I yeah. yeah. But I mean, you know, you got some nice tires on here. You got the extension. You're starting to really customize it. So. I mean, I might be willing to just throw the two hundred bucks in instead of buying a new. Yeah, bike. that's you know, it, I, it's, you know, I like the bike. Yeah, 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 that's, my yeah needs. that's what I'm getting at. Yeah. Turnaround time on something like that, uh, about a couple of days. If you're riding it every day, I gotta get some lube on that chain. Right. So the, if, I if I drop it off on, let's say, like Monday. Be ready for next weekend? Oh, absolutely. Right, no, that's, that's what we do. Right. Cuz I'm going to be I'm going to work from here on Monday. You're welcome. You what's that? You leave from here I work on Monday. I'm going to work here all day on Monday. Oh, okay. Throw it into the Jeep and bring it over. Throw it in the Jeep, bring it over, and then when you come back out on Friday, we'll be ready for you. Perfect. What's your first name? Jason. Jason, nice to meet you. I'm Bart. That's right. Mark, and this is Fred right. here with the beard. You get air I did. Yeah, cool. yeah, I knew I was a little low on the uh, big in the time. Back You'll see a big difference. Okay, great. You're so you think thing. that noise is coming from? Uh, oh, it's definitely. Yeah. Well, we, he checked your wheels. I your did wheels the same are thing. not. Your yeah. wheels are not rubbing. Yeah. So it's more likely. You know, it's just there's a lot of grit. Right. Yeah. Because when I got the cup slug, I got off the bike. I heard it when I was riding. Mm -hmm. So I got the cup slug. I got off. I spun the wheels, mm -hmm. and I didn't really hear it. But then as soon as I got back on the bike, you heard it again. I could hear it again. Yeah. So I guess it makes sense. Yeah, it, yeah it's, it, it's making sense what we're talking about oh, there for right, sure. So I'll drop it up on uh, either late Sunday or Monday. Sunday we're probably, open until 3. Then I'll probably drop it Monday in all honesty. You're on. Thank you. Appreciate your business. Have Enjoy the day, huh? Awesome. I'll wash my hands. Thanks a lot. Yeah, appreciate it. Tell me how high my seat should be because I'm not afraid. You're not afraid? I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. I can tell her as well. I'm like flashing his head. I don't think this is high enough. Get a seat. Now, again, take your helmet. That way you got that. It's all about safety for you as well. Right. You know, if you don't feel comfortable with where it should be, then lower it down. But kind of a general rule, really close to me. Okay, step away. Oh wow. Full rule would be about there, yeah. kind of hip bone. You ain't gonna be able to sit on there. Now, get the butt off of the seat. This way. Come forward. Come forward. Ah, okay. Now, well, you're, you're gonna make a commitment. You yeah. got and commit. Don't hesitate. Push off and then get your ass up right. on the seat. I'm fine with that. I'll give it a try. Good luck. You know how to. You you know how to change it if you have to. It's really simple. So you're good. Uh, you might not want. Yeah, get out there. Not encumbered. Yeah, you got the idea. Start spreading the news. City that never sleeps. Boom, boom. Da 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 Dun, dun, dun. Repair time. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. Winchester, what is the good word with you today? What are you licking on? Marco, I'm putting your bike over here. 
Gee, come on, let's go. Help me out here. Let's get some calls going, get these things written up. Let's get them out of here. I need the space bad. And you're so good at it. Oh, we just had a little butterfly fly away. Fly away, butterfly. All right. We didn't even get a chance to look this week. And then I, I'll, I'll see what I can do about these ones over here. I think I'm, I'm thinking about maybe condensing. So, all right, I'll take care. I'll, I'll take care of the management of the repairs. You just take care of the writing them up and calling them up. I'll take care of the rest of it. I don't know. We're gonna let her run for a little bit here. I don't know. You know, we had a <coughs> a guy on this past week after the syndicated show from the laptop. That was. Uh, he was pretty mean. Um, he was pretty mean, calling us unprofessional, and it, his his handle was TV sucks or TV is dead or something to that degree, right? Something along the lines of that he is a internet troller. Here's a really old hope surfer, guys. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if you're into surfing, but this thing is ancient. One of my oldies from way back. I did not buy this surfboard new. This surfboard is older than I am. I'm going to put it over here for now. And strap it to the Wiggles wagon and go catch a couple of waves. So, TV, he was going off and telling us this and telling us how to do that and telling us how to do this. And I got a message from Mr. TV. Suck an egg. <laughs> okay? That's the bottom line. You know, you don't have to watch. Click away. See you later. You don't like the program? Turn the freaking Exactly. You know, there, I had to go last week. I had to go live last week because all you guys want and expecting to talk to each other. Again, we are a family. This is unlike any other entertainment out there. Educational, it's entertainment, it's live raw reality, it just it's an unscripted, it just doesn't get better in real world entertainment than us. Period. So Mr. T V go away. Alright, we gotta break down this this crate too that that thing came in. You still got this thing here, he's coming back. Larry's coming, isn't he? Larry, after the after the service, oh, yeah, that's right. let's get this. Uh, give me a little t quickie. This is the pedicab guy's bike. Give this a little tune 'em up key. Service has got to be almost coming close to being done. Maybe you got to ride home. All right, we got that. We got that. She's working over hard over there. All right, so we're gonna put some of these ones over there. Is what I think we're gonna do. And I think it's only three or four. Is it one person? No. No, it's more than one person. Does anybody have any good plans for Father's Day? I don't have any plans for Father's Day. That's not all bad. I'm not upset about that. That's okay by me. I was kind of having a hankering. I recently discovered a delicious recipe. Lobster on the grill. Take a little lobster and you slice it right down the middle. crack -a but before you crack it right down the middle, you have to do it on a cutting board that has big heavy duty tin foil on it because you're going to wrap that bad boy up in foil after it comes You don't want to lose any of the juices that come out of it when it... You with me? So now, after we have taken care of our lobster, we've cracked them down the middle 
and we now put in pats of butter in between the crack. Along with the pats of butter, I give it a squirt of a lime, okay? And then very carefully, you drip tequila, preferably, <laughs> preferably, okay? A good tequila like a Patron or something like that. And you don't go nutsy cuckoo, but you just drip it in there. Seal the whole thing up, throw it on the grill. Check it in 10, 15 minutes. Mm! Now, if you infuse your drawn butter with a little tequila and lime juice with it, in the butter that you dip your lobster in after you take it out of the shell, it's killer. The Indians used to use that thing for fertilizer. What things? Well, the Indians were smart, <laughs> you know, hey. Just telling you, that's what they did with it. Well, it's fertilizer, all right. I thought Indians were smarter than that, to tell you the truth. All right, this is all one person right here. Boy, it sure would be nice if we could get rid of all three of those, Al. Maybe she came out this weekend. All right, now I got two other ones, and then I got a single one. Right. You don't eat lobster, Fred? No, I don't eat those nasty things. You don't eat them nasty things? Why are you calling them nasty? They're gross. Bottom huh? feeders. Bottom feeders. It's all good in my book, boys and girls. It just doesn't get... They use them for eel bait. For eel bait? Uh-huh. Lobster's worth more than the eel. Crack a couple of horseshoe crabs with an axe and throw them in the pot, I guarantee you. I don't think it's legal, is it? Yeah. It is legal? Yeah, you can catch you can catch two hundred. Every night they're down there. This one here? Yeah, these guys need writing up, and they're going to need calling up. There's three right there. There's all on the back. And then these two go with this guy. Every night, the do-go to the lobster tigers or pike's meat down there. And they put them in the pot and they put them in the pot. 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 And all the guys that have the permission down there catching them 200, filling their boat up, and then they're killing them. And they have a war down there every night. When's this? It's been going on for months. What, on full moons? Yeah. Full moon is when the horseshoe crabs come out in abundance and they like to, uh, they're, Lay their eggs. They're, well, Dad, this they're, is they're quite, this is delivery. Yeah, so call her up and get paid and tell her we're going to deliver them ASAP. We're going to deliver them until we get the money in hand. And then I got this one we're going to put over there as well. Well, this is a one of two, too. Cindy. Oh no, this is ours. This bike is ours. This is a this is a sell. This is a. Uh, they took the, they took the other one and gave us this one in 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 payment. Oh yeah. yeah. <coughs> um, let's put a regular Manila on this. It's a sweet bike, man. This is sweet. It's all service. It's ready to go. It's worth two hundred bucks all day, every day. Are we selling it? Or yeah, sell it. Okay, let's put a tag on. Used. It. That's what I'm going. Used bike, two hundred dollars. I would try not to go lower than that no, on that. I wouldn't go lower than that. That's a nice, too nice of a bike. Okay, that can go in a used bike pile, so we don't have to worry about that. Allie's got this going there. Again, we're getting all caught up. Now, I got, does anybody know about these two junkers? One of them was a Nicole from last weekend that just wasted our time. That was this one, Nicole. This is the one with the kids last Sunday, last week. You weren't, were you around? No, it's only, it's only on Monday. This is ours. And then this piece of junk here is uh, this Roadmaster. This is about the most piece of, biggest piece of junk you ever saw in your life. This thing is not ours. That is ours too. <coughs> but I was going to salvage the magma for whatever we call it. This Roadmaster? These grips are, the, the, the shifters are about the only thing that's worth anything. Yeah. All right. I got to go take a call from nature. N uh, not that Roadmaster, no way. 
not safe. All right. Give me a little mute. She's coming in. I don't remember. I don't remember what Bart said about how much the bike guy left there.
one you pulled right in front where, Tony? I got it right there. Which one is she talking about? This red. And where where was that from? This one. There's another one in here if we need it. Small red? Mm-hmm. Okay. So talking about Nicole is coming in. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, and Mark pulled the bike right here. Right. I have another red one here in case. In case I didn't know that that one was a helicopter. You're all. It's going to be done in two seconds. Just got up. Okay. Is that okay? I have another red one, if need be. Exact the route, small here, if needed. But you pull. I put the red. I put the because I had sold Nicole. You. Yeah, no, I know. Well, if it's easy, we just take. The yeah. Whatever. It's all good. It's all good. Uh oh. I don't know what bar, what deduction is. She's gotta, I, he's gotta give me off, give him that bike. Okay, that's, okay. So now we're, now we know. Okay, there is no deduction. Cause I was just asking about that, about this bicycle. This was Nicole's. So this thing, there is no deduction. In fact, if she would like to d get rid of it, we will have to charge her a dispose. We will waive the disposal fee because she's purchasing a new bike. Okay. If she wasn't purchasing a new bike, to get rid of it would cost her 20 bucks. Okay. Get with me. Right. That's, that's standard right. operating procedure for us. I have absolutely no use for this itty bitty small bike. I'm gonna put it right over here. We'll have her, bike, her new bicycle will be right. No, you know what, we'll get it over here so that way she could get it out of here. <laughs> cool. I don't want it. Now, if we could get hold of Fernandez for these three, that would be awesome, too. Delivery bike. Which one? Oh. That's a disaster. That was a disaster. That was a bad move. Tony Joe delivering a bike before it got paid yes, last week. And the credit card didn't go through. Bike's gone. Did they get it straight now? Not yet. Not yet. Eight hundred dollar bill. That's a bad move. That's a bad move on Tony's part. That's why we have procedures. What well, was all happening so quickly that it was, you know, it was like, okay, it's getting delivered. Okay, I'll call her. Okay, here's the credit card, you know. It was all, but it was all hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, you know. And I hurried, and it, I got stung in the butt. But, you know, again, but Tony's owning up to it. She knows that she screwed it up, and she's fixing it, like, a good move. I'm not, you know. She's fixing it. She's handling it. She's gonna sit, take the care of the situation. All right. We're gonna have to do something about. Oh, now this roadmaster is back into its. All right. Hello. How are you? You can go straight in that back door. That didn't look like a call. All right, I'm gonna unlock these and can these, you know. You gonna need to get the other one or what? What's that? Restroom. Restroom? Yeah. Through the back door. Right and a right. I got a public restroom now? Shitty weather.
our village could do so much more to help out the business community, uh, the summer business community that we have here. It really pisses me off the way that the village fathers do not support the local businesses at all, uh, especially in the retail environment. But it makes a lot of sense because they are not, they're not business people, they're politicians. Unfortunately, some of them are, two of them are business people, but the head is a lawyer. And she is just not cutting it in my book. And the village elections were yesterday. Yesterday's village elections, um, it was all incumbents, so I did not even vote. There was no propositions, there was nothing. I did not vote because there was no need to vote. Um, if there was somebody else running, then I would have voted. But there was no uh, good or bad, however you want to, you know, whatever. There was no, there was not a choice with the village election. So I assume that the village elections turned out the way they were. All right. Daughter's beautiful. What was that? Daughter's beautiful. Oh, thanks. Takes it after her mother. I was about to say, not the sound surprising. <laughs> You're a hot ticket. Ah, uh, all right. So uh, our secondary lineup over here, Makito, is empty now. But our primary repair pickup is full. It will be if. Uh, after I put these five in here, um, just to let you know, she's working on it right now. Here's, uh, I don't know what these are here. All right. All right, good deal. All right, let's see what we got. What do you got on there? Anything good, Fred? Nothing good? Um, what is this? We're not out of kickstands. What? Kickstands? So, did we start a new J&B order? No. I, Not yet? He told me as I was At 5 o'clock. Yeah. Okay. And I put Miracle Mirrors on you, post it on your computer. Okay, right, so I'm going to start, let's and open and up a new, let's get a new J&B order started so that way we're, it's open. Okay. In case anybody needs anything, this, all right? All right. You'll take a handle that for me. Get kickstands on there. We'll take a whole box. All right. Um, and in terms of that uh, Miracle Mirrors, uh, what do you want, 20? I've got a couple of, yeah, if they have a pack, 10, get 20, get, yeah, 20, 30. Get, get a two master I mean, packs. Fourth of July is in two weeks, might as well have maybe. Yeah, I agree. Well, it's going to help you out to make, make freight. Yeah. So, I'm, anybody find my glasses yet? Let me see what we got going on over here. 
Let me put on my dark sunglasses to read this. Is he? I don't know. Scorching here in the UK for once. Our temperature today is what about 65, 70? I'm guessing. <laughs> Maybe he'll go from a peeing customer to a paying customer. I like that. That's funny. It's brand new, just put to, it's all put together, it's put together by pros in about a hundred hours come in because the brakes and the cables are gonna shift. I mean they're gonna stretch, yeah. so just a normal tightening. You know, so you know, end of the end of the summer or you know before the And then as far as changing your gears, yeah. always when you're pedaling forward, this shifter right here controls your rear derailleur and your chain has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven positions. Can't get it loose. All right, Eddie, you want help with that? I'm going to help you out with that. You got an Allen key situation. First off, what kind of Allen key are you using? Is it a six or is it an eight? What is the play? What size of Allen key is it? Whatever it may be. Okay. You got to get yourself a good Allen key. If you don't have a good Allen key, get one. If you still have just a regular Allen key, put a little something over the end of it. You said it's a 10 millimeter? Or an eight millimeter, whatever yeah, it may be. Going. Yeah. Can you help Nicole load this in the in the car? Sure. And I'll write you up. I'll meet you inside. Okay. Cool. Right. Then come on in after you get it in, Nicole. Okay. I follow I you. A, um, mirror too. Okay. Right. You absolutely. You can go inside and see her, and then we'll put it on for you. Oh. Okay. So we're gonna leave it here then. Well, <laughs> we're not loading it at all. Maybe I'll get the mirror another day. Whatever you want me to do, Nicole. Okay, so we're gonna put this in there. Okay, and we're throwing out this one. Is that what I'm hearing? This was your old one. What's that? It's dead. Euthanized. What do you think? All right, where are we going? Into that thing there. All right. There's no way it's gonna fit in and close. into the box and close unless I start taking wheels off and all of the above. Uh, if you put the let's tie from back side Okay. That's it. Like I said, it's not going to go in and close. How? It'll be fine. How? You all right? It's okay with the cops. Yeah, you'll be all right. You had a cops. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The cops are the cops, man. You know? say play stupid. I don't. Oh, I don't know. I, Da, 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 da. Do, 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 do. Hey, uh, while you're on there with J&B, give me uh, bungee cords, all right? Some 24-inch bungee cords. Can yeah. you work your magic with the bike on that bike? Yeah, sure. I'm gonna have that. Let me pull it out and cut it off well, and, I and bring it around. It's going to take, gonna take me about 10 minutes, mm -hmm. 5 minutes. Da, 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 da. Hey, Bart. Yes, dear? It's okay, because this guy's like... So what do I do? Do I put this on? Yes or no, Nicole? What am I doing? No. All right, I'm going to go get a bungee cord out of that trunk down, right? Is that what I'm doing? Okay. Uh, Nicole, whatever you want, my dear. See, he's an Uber driver. Where did, uh... Oh, my dad took a Oh, he's an Uber driver. Okay. He's not a customer at all, guys. You guys are all saying he's a customer. He ain't a customer. He's an Uber driver. No, I, that's why I asked the call. I said, oh, is he with you? She said, oh, he's my driver. Mm -hmm. yeah, okay. Now we're starting to come together. Now we're starting to understand what's going on. I'm starting to catch on. Mr. You're an Uber guy. I see. I see. Where are you from? 
Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Great political stuff going on in Sri Lanka, don't they? Mr. Uber. He's from Sri Lanka. He's not India. I bet you the people from Sri Lanka get pissed off if you tell say that they're from India. But he's pretty he's pretty astute. Pakistani, huh? You think? Yeah, all right with that. I don't know. Don't know? All right. I don't know either, but I don't know if I would put it there. How the hell did you get it in there? No, that's no good. Hold that thing down. Hold that down. Just like that, all right? That's good. Just like that. Don't move. All right, you're on. Have fun. Bye bye. Uber. Oh, righty. Oh, the weather outside is frightful. All right. He wasn't a customer. He wasn't a peeing customer turned into a paying customer. He was an Uber. <laughs> He's an Uber driver. That lady. Oh, so back to Eddie and his problem with a with a with a, a Allen key and trying to get the pedal out. All right. So the pedal is in the crank, and you can't remember now. You got to remember that the pedal goes backwards, right, to tighten. But now I'm operating, everything is operating from inside of here. So position it to wherever, and it's going to go backwards or here and down for that one, right? So keep working your angle for your wrench Allen key to get in there. Now, if you still get the right angle and you've got somebody holding the other side, again, play with it until you find the right positioning. With your, if your Allen key is not long enough and you can't get enough leverage, this happens to be a long eight millimeter, but it might be a six in there. Take an open end box or any a little piece of pipe or something and put that on the end of it like that. So now I can tighten it. I got a little longer lever. Now, if you had a small piece of heavy duty pipe, that would work too. Um, but you got to get something on there to make it longer to be able to get the leverage that you need. Hence, a 10 millimeter that's like an 8 millimeter like this. Now, if you just have a regular homeowner six, it's only about this millimeter, this long, and you definitely put something else on it. Have somebody help you to hold the bicycle to get it solid. Worst case scenario, you're gonna need the EVT safe zone mirror with the Allen key attachment, okay? We have, this is an Allen key attachment and this goes into here to be able to do what you gotta do. It will come out. Remember, left hand, left hand thread. Left pedal, left hand thread. Both pedals tighten in the direction that the bike goes. So that means to get them off, they got to go backwards. But now you're dealing with the backside. So really think and get it into a good position so that you're ready. What are you doing over there? Eating a peach. Nice. It's a what? A cling stone. Oh, geez. What does that mean? Cling stone means that the, uh, the uh, stone. Yeah. The seed 
Yeah. Clings to the meat. Oh. So as you peel it off, you get ch uh, chunks of meat. Oh. Oh. It's another bad one. Oh. How'd you do on that, uh, that the air in the tires, you give it a little check over? Checked it over, the bike's fine. I saw a little looseness in that handlebar, did you take care of that? A looseness in the uh, stem? Yeah. I don't know about the headset, but just the handlebar itself. It did tighten it, but the... Around, you know, all the adjusting bolts, the adjusting this, adjusting part of the stem itself. Yeah, you see that? Yeah. All right. I'm going to get these three the heck out of here. I wonder if you got a hold of them. What's that? Yeah, it's fine. Better? Yeah. Good. Was it loose? Uh, a little bit? Yeah. Yeah. Now, these Cali helmets that she so conveniently put up here, where are they going? Downstairs? <clears throat> what did you do? Pull new pumps from surface, that surface order that was down there? Yeah. Good. So, gotta get out of the way. Again. No, no, no. It's all, All right, I'm about ready for lunch. How far can you throw a Huffy? How far can you throw a Roadmaster bike? What's that? Film it. Instagram uh, video. How far can you throw us, Roadmaster? Ooh. Will it break? I think it would. Will it ride? This young man needs air in his tires. Oh, man. <laughs> oh you noticed. I thought it was just my weight. Oh, you, oh no, it ain't you. <laughs> what else you got for me, my friend? Let's see. You did everything last year. Down. Yeah, she's looking pretty good. Yeah. Uh, when you get her home, after you ride through some more water out there, if yeah. you ha you know it's tough to avoid it, but you can see all the gook yeah. and the sh crap and how it's a yeah. you know just take it take it to the garden hose. Yeah, garden hose. Just, just give it a good good, good work. Yeah. Because if you leave that sh schmutz on there, yeah. it, it's not it's you know it's salt embedded and it's it's yeah, deadly. It's, corroded, yeah. it's deadly. <laughs> but there's not much else to do today out here except for ride your bike, huh? That's true. How's town? Is town busy down there? I'm going to go through it now. I'll let oh. you know. All right. Uh, if you see anybody down there, tell them to come on up. And, yeah, and they, you know, you should ride a bike, like rent a bike or tell them something, man, will you? Uh, get some yeah, drum me up some business, will you? I'll see what I got, a sign I'll, or I'll, something? I'll put you up, 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 a commission later, all right? Why don't you put me and get me a sign? Uh, so a right sandwich sure. sign right yeah, over right, the top. Exactly. Yeah. All right. Enjoy your day, huh? Take care. You too. Thanks again. Oh yeah, she's a lot easier. I bet. <laughs> Alright, that covers that. So I guess we're just going to build bikes out until we can't build them anymore. That's the name, pl just name of the game. Arizona's in the house. What's happening, Geo Sam? Late, better late than never. We're back in action this week, uh, if you didn't notice. Who's going Ethiopian today? Me? 
<laughs> no lunch today. If you look up three-year-old vids, Bart is pretty slim. Yeah, as a matter of fact, three years ago, yeah, I was pretty slim. <laughs> what are you saying? I'm not slim now, Forbin? What are you talking about, huh? Fighting you. weight. What's new with you, Kevin Grover? Please expand upon the butt. Hey, Derek Hefner's in the house. What's happening, Derek? Good to see you. Thanks for pumping up on that uh, on on the amount of uh, hi from Utah, Joey, Joe, Joe, Joe Cozen. What's happening, man? Any good shops in Pittsburgh area? I bet you Pittsburgh's got a lot of shops. <clears throat> Do I know of any good ones? No. Thanks, Don. The fellow that washes our bikes. His name is Sebastian. Doesn't work on Saturday. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing well and yourself. I'm okay, thank you. Just okay, huh? Yeah, okay. Well, how well, can I make it better? Well, the sun was out. It'd be better, right? Oh, uh, no, I can't help you with that. Can't help that. <laughs> Sorry, I, I, I you, you, I, nobody else wants the sun to come out more than we do. <laughs> I bet bikes you can do sun now. Uh, so this needs a lot of TLC, I think. A lot of it? No, I don't know. I was riding it. I just put some air on the tires with a pump. I don't know if they're the right. Okay. Yeah. Something flew off here and hit me in the head. Something flew off of there and there hit you in the head, here. huh? There was something There was something... Like a head. plug or something that covered something that up? Something covered it and went flying off. All right, I can put a little... Undo undo you got a little Allen right? key cover head thingy here. And then it's making a funny um, squeaky noise. Like a grindy? Cheek, 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 squeaky. Okay. What mm -hmm. else? Well, that's it. All right. Let's stick it up here in the wreck. It, sa it sounds like, you know, you, you made it sound like I was going to admit it and have to, <laughs> and have to gut take it to x ray <laughs> exactly. and, and maybe over to Dyke, you know. <laughs> maybe it was beyond repair. Yeah. I mean, you were making it sound like it was horrendous. So, so far, you haven't given me anything. Not anything to really. No, really no, no, no. Yeah, it makes like a rubbing noise, like a squeak rubbing noise when you ride up. Now, one of, you know, if it was making a noise, it... There it is. There it is. There it is. That's the noise. Dark. Yeah, that's it. That's what it sounds like. A squeaky, like a squeaky, uh, I figure out the wheels are going to fall off. I don't know, tap poor it. thing. Oh. Sits there forever. I've got another one I need to bring up to, but I figure I'll start with this one. Oh, how many bikes you got, lady? You know what's so funny? I kept all of the kids as they were growing up. I've got a ton of the little ones, too. I must have three, five. Oh, my goodness. You're setting up a little I've annex a over there. One, I've got two of these, and then I've got a little you got me a little plug one. thing in there? It's stuck in there. You did it already for me? Oh, gee, thanks. You not have enough air in this thing. Well, you know, so I rode it last weekend because it was so pretty, and I just had one of those bicycle pumps, and I had no idea what I was doing. All right. Well, you got enough in it to be able to have a little fun. That was good. But now you're up to enough that's well, going to make it a little bit more enjoyable. Air and this flying off and the squeaky noise, I thought for sure the whole thing was just going to fall apart when uh, I was uh -huh. it, and I would be like... Well, oh, it's it's no youngster of a bike, but it ain't no, bad. It's, not, it's, it's an in, old bike. Yeah, it's in pretty good shape, though. I mean, wherever you're keeping it is in a good yeah, spot. Yeah, I just keep in the garage. You like that, don't you? For, oh, I don't like that. Uh, rear like U brake. It's a one-hit wonder by Shimano that year. What the uh, rear U brake? I don't really like. Them. Oh, they're nothing but trouble. When they work right, they're okay. But if they don't work right, thank goodness this one works okay. Yeah. They are a mess because it just collects up the grit. So oh, sorry, no. That's a pretty shiny bike. Oh, yes. You don't look old enough to own a bicycle of this age, my yeah, dear. Uh, well, I know, you know what? Uh, You're doing something right. Keep up the good God, work. Right? All the uh, vitamins and all the lotions and potions. Oh, yeah, you're into that stuff. Well, it's working for you. Keep up the good work. All right. 
air and the tires we took care of. I put another little pluggy thing in here that really doesn't do much other than. I, that. I thought yeah. the thing was going to fall off. I said, no, I don't, I don't see anything else that's falling off. I'm okay. all good. Okay. Uh, we got proper air in there. I got a little lube on the chain. I took care of that little, that, that zzz 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 noise. It was really easy. It was just this little cable was kind of hitting on the, on, the, on the tire a little bit. So we fixed that. Okay. Uh, you're good to go. All right. So what do you think? Oh yeah, you know, you're doing good. You know, a little, good. little safety check here. You know, hit the brakes. It's looking good. You can stop. Yeah, I can stop. I can stop. What a, do I owe you, sir? A smile. That's it. Air and the tires, oh, and that little quickie. You. That was an easy one for you. Oh, thank you. I'll bring the other one up. Maybe that one. I mean, you, know, you are wearing a Cali Protective helmet. That <laughs> was purchased right. from us. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. It's a good yeah. helmet, right? Works good, doesn't it? I think so. I you mean, think so? You haven't had to necessarily use I it. Thank, thank God. goodness. Exactly, because you never know around right. here. People but it's pretty Indy comfortable on you. you know? It's pretty. Yeah, the drivers around here sometimes, sometimes on the weekend is a little. On the weekend, they think it's the Indy 500. These maniacs. Well, they gotta get past the next guy. Well, they don't drive during the week so they want to get it all in on one you know on yeah and they have these sports cars that should be on yeah. the autobahn and not exactly the so West they want to open runs. it up open it up a little bit they want to clean the cobwebs out you know enjoy have fun ride safe you, have a good day. you too bye bye, bye. ever read popeye no coincidence bye bye All right, so that covers that. Back at you, boys and girls. What else you got for me, guys? How about you? Roscoe? Notice. I got a notice to renew the license tag for my scooter. It's more than a car and pickup tags combined. For your scooter, huh? You mean like as a motor? Sell a tune-up, damn it. I couldn't. The bike was too good. Investing in Kevlar line tires is the best investment I made on my bike yet. Uh, yeah, they Kevlar. There could be a difference between a folding tire. Most of the time, when people tell me they got Kevlar tires, it means it's a folding tire, and the bead is Kevlar. Now, if it has some sort of a belting in there, years and years ago it used to be Kevlar belted, but nowadays they use this other fancy plaque plastic stuff. So, just because you're Kevlar, it could be the bead that's Kevlar, not necessarily the part to touch the road. Hence, BMX boy, this is, has a wire bead inside of here, and you can leave it all folded up, man. You can tell the whole idea right there. There, there is the Kevlar bead, bead is here. See how this whole tire is all folded up? Kevlar. So this is Kevlar here. But the tire is a better tire to begin with. So, you know, that could be part of your deal. But now if you wanted to get real action this is a survivor zoom in here nice and tight son of a this is a surface survivor these tires are bulletproof this happens to be a 723c but you can see a double protection right there and right there inside of you it's very rarely that we have customers come in with flat tires on these tires and they keep them if they keep them pumped up right you got that son of a yes no maybe earth to bubba loop come in bubba loop Hey buddy, how's it coming in in there? You I'm looking here. The, uh, Come on, son. and Tony Joe. You might be in the uh, in the can. A bathroom. Well, anyway, it's got two belts on it. They do make, this tire is a sidewall resistant because the inner liner is from bead to bead, okay? So, Forbin, so I strongly you, recommend that you get yourself. So, if you run over that metal strap. Wish the Survivor came in at 32. There's Forrest Thomas. Forrest Thomas, I'm working on those. I, 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 told, I gave you a shout out earlier. I'm, I'm sorry about those tires that you haven't gotten yet. I'm working on it. Is that the guy with the, uh, Question BFFU, tubular tire quick check for air pressure using thumbs. Tubular? I don't uh, know. Tubular should be whatever the tire states. It should be tubular. Glue on. Are you sure they're tubular? Um, Michael Murray's talking about uh, Bontrager hard case tires. Bought them from a suggestion of the bike mechanic. That is a good move. Listen to your local bike guy. 
Surface Survivor Tires. That is correct. Why are we questioning, Corbin? You're welcome, Forrest. Maybe he's playing Flappy Bird? No. Uh, he he's got be. one of them ball things with a hook on it. Oh, God. What do you call it? You know, the thing you... Yeah. It's a really old-timey toy. If you had to stop selling Giant, would you ever consider Diamondback? They have a great selection and the quality is good. Carmelo, you are correct. Diamondback makes a nice bike. The only problem with Diamondback is that they are undercutters big time and they are internet. We used to do a Diamondback bike because we could sell them on the internet. That was a big mistake we made selling bikes on the internet. So it just ended up to be a disaster. The shipping for the bicycles cost more than what it needed. And traditionally, the Diamondbacks are sold at Dick's or this one or that one. Does Dick's have Diamondback? Yeah. And I, if I was to sell them, I can't make that much money. I don't make enough money on Giants as it is, let alone selling another inexpensive brand such as Diamondback. Uh, I think if I'm going to go any route, I'm going to go to the route of not selling any bikes and just fix them. Just fix. Maybe a couple of bikes, you know, something here, but nothing, nothing like what the, the, the amounts that we're doing now. How close are we to doing that? Doing what? Going just, just, ju just fixing them? I don't know. We'll see what happens after this season. It just, you know, it, it giant makes things worse and worse and worse for us. And so does every, all the rest of them are all the same. So I'm not, I'm not just picking on giant. I'm picking on giant because I know giant. Uh, here we are mid-season to giant. I got, a, I got an email. Mid-season. Aren't we mid-season right now in the bicycling industry around the country, would you call that? Around the country. Okay, well that's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the big manufacturers, Giant. And we, we're in the mid-season and Giant decides that they're going to change their trucker. They are no longer using New England Motor Freight as of yesterday. Really? Mm-hmm. This is the whole thing. So now if it's going out here, it sounds like it could be either Old Dominion or it could be... I don't know, somebody else, oh, wow. uh, on time trucking or something like that it was, I don't know. And so they changed, just to let you know. So again, another problem that I got to deal with. Uh, oh, and then now, now they're talking about how oh, you can either, now all giant bicycles, this is another thing, now here, here we go. You know, we just get used to it, and we, we, we didn't particularly care to collect in pallets either, but you know what, we collected them and we got rid of them. We do what we had to do, but some shops are bitching about the fact hey, that hey, they hey. come palletized flat, flat. and okay. that they have to get rid of the pallets of the shops, okay? So now, if you want them palletized, which if they're palletized, they come in a lot better. Of course, we never order bikes by single pieces, very rarely, I should say, not never. Most of the time, we'll make our freight allowment of 10 bikes or whatever, and then they palletize them, they wrap it all up in plastic, and they're not all loose all over the place such as when the truck pulls in and they're flopped all over the place and they're coming out, which happened it did the other day. this day. Yeah. There they didn't come in on a palletized jack, okay? So then they came in and some of the bottoms are falling out of the bikes and the, oh, I got bikes in here that are upside down because the bottom fell out. So they're not palletizing anymore unless you specifically request it. We have to state it now? Yeah. Now, if you request a palletization of the, you have to be prepared to be able to take it. If you want the lift gate to be used, you got to get charged. You're going to get charged the lift gate, meaning the lift gate that lowers them down. And then, if you don't have a dolly, which usually the, the truck does, the truck does, and the truck, all of that, yeah. you you also are, you know, the, the he's just going to take it down. Now that's an another additional charge. Okay. He's going to just drop it. But on a different note, I was advised by our friend on the North Fork that coming up here real quick, there's not going to be any freight minimum. One bike will get you free freight. Because they want to get rid of their old models. Here comes the sale. Whatever, Here comes that sale that we were talking about. When is that? When did he say that was going Coming to happen? Coming up. Like, sooner than later. So, is it set, you know? It's just getting tougher and tougher to deal with these big bicycle manufacturers. It's brutal, man. It's brutal. Is he sneak? Is Antonio back in action there? Antonio, are you back in action? I don't yeah, know if you. Oh, is that what you needed? Two new, two new identical fuel pumps going to my car, yeah. 
Two of them. Each? No. Oh, all right. Because it has to be super fuel. That's so, what I said so we were looking here, too. son of a. They, I wanted to show the guys the, the the label on this, if you could. All right, what do you guys want from us? I don't care. You guys want pizza? You want Chinese? You want country helos? Ready? What do you you want? We don't have well. We got such a bad quality of uh, air today here. You want to do pizza? Sure. That ain't too bad. I hit your focus button when you're there. I'll uh, slices, please. Two buffalo? Yes, please. Fred. Oh, 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 oh. I got what it. What if I stand there with my black shirt? And that doesn't matter. It's so he gets in so tight it doesn't. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I stand there. Pizza. pizza. Buffalo chicken pizza, not I. All right. Dun, 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 dun. Um. All right. Well, what is it, 12.30? Time for lunch? Time to get the heck out of here? Yeah. Time to sign off? I got some projects going on that are off off campus. What's that? Yeah, yeah, both. Foggy, twelve thirty, phones ringing, money. He doesn't eat motor oil, he drinks motor oil. He eats fan belts. Real world news. Real world news, all of the above, choice D. Thank you, Rent the Trip. That's a good that's a good uh, good move. Yes, I can. Thank you, Brian. Happy Father's Day to you. A special sauce on the pizza. I'm not thinking about running for the village board. I'm thinking about running for the mayor. You're going for the whole Next thing. year. Enchilada. Maybe. I doubt it, but maybe. You never know. This guy wants air. There you go. Young man. How are you doing today? You having fun yet? You're out there doing it, that a boy. Keep up the good work. I don't think I need much air. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you need it. Bad, bad. You're at 20 and it takes 80. Okay, you're gonna see, you're gonna get there. Now you're not gonna be huffing and puffing so much. Yeah, yeah. You have much better gas mileage. Uh huh. We put new tires on this thing recently. It was last year, maybe, huh? This is an old rental. It's a good old bike. I know, yeah. You, you can see a little... Yeah, I you remember. We were talking about... We had ended our conversation this morning, as a matter of fact. Exactly. All our old rentals. This is a duct tape on it. This is really... This is a Ross Chimera. This is a really old one. This is the one you gave at the end. Well, it's number one. Does it seem a little easy, too easy to pedal for? Yeah. If you want to make it a little harder to pedal, while you're pedaling, just click it to you. It's three. going to make it a little bit harder to pedal. Okay, let's put it in three and see how you do with number three. That should. That's why I push it back to two. Yeah. yeah. Thank you very much. Harder to pedal, higher the number. Easier to pedal, lower the number. Enjoy the day. Ross Chimera. That bike is 30 years old. Maybe not quite. 25.
We need some grips. Guys, what's happening? All right today. I'm doing well, and yourselves? Good. Need some new grips and a few things for his bike? Sure. Let's take a look at his bike here, and we'll probably be putting it on. Why don't you bring it around? And let's check it out. grips we need for this thing. And uh, Marco, what do we got in terms of grips? Specialized hard rock. Uh -huh. All right, you can head inside there and this guy right here and go check out a couple of different stuff that we got. What else are we doing in this thing besides what grips? We, need? we just got it on the road, so. We just got it on the road? This is rolling good now. This was a little stuck to break, so we, I loosened up here, I think, is that right? or? Yeah. Okay. Wait, don't we need to do little screws for the air? Caps for your valves? All right. And then the That's air, easy enough. The air wasn't going in. Uh, that's the pump. The pump, pump's fine. Pump is good. Pump is back in action. All right, so we'll put a little air in there. We'll, we'll double check and make sure you did all right. We'll sure, get some yeah. caps on there. Other than that, sounds like a good plan, huh? You got your seat raised while you're here? On your bike? Yeah, I need my seat raised. I'll race. bring it over here. All right, well, but this one, there's nothing else going on except for we're going to go look at Chris. Yeah. yeah. Whoops, sorry. Looks okay? Yeah, yeah, it looks not too bad. Why, what do you mean by it just got on the road? I just brought it from uh, uh, from uh, our house, so we haven't used it since last. We haven't yeah. used the thing ever. Actually, this is, yeah, someone gave me this bike, so yeah, it's not a bad little bike, actually. Let's see what kind of air you got in there. Grips are going to be inside, guys, so, so you go, can go check it out grips, inside. Whatever kind of grips you want, some big ones, small ones. I'll come in. Bags right here, Frank. You're going to change your seat thing. Let's go. All right, that. and we're going to raise your seat up. Is that what I'm hearing, young man? Yeah. We'll check out your air pressure too while we're at it. Sound like a good idea? All right, you're on. That thing is styling there. Done. I, yai, yai. Sure they're not fit. See, go, go we'll make them fit. Yeah, we're gonna, the size of those and you're gonna see we can right actually there. put that in a little bit, but we can also cut it down. No, these, are, these are perfect. Look at those. Lil. Those are better. Yeah, that's the same those, exact grip. Those are perfect. Those, perfect. Are, those are the those way are to go, not yep. these. That's easy enough. We'll put those on for you. I'll put them over here for a minute. Oh, Daddy, can I get like a, a water bottle? It's tough to put a water bottle on your bike, young man. What about my bike? Yeah, both of you guys. Well, they're both the same size. Your best bet is going to be to put your water bottle in a backpack. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, putting it on the bike is going to be tough. The only other place we could do it is putting it up on the handlebar, which could be difficult. Daddy, when, can I, when should I get the wheels? Never. When they run out, when they wear out? When is that? When you drive it about 100 miles? You'll put some time onto it. <laughs> what else? Anything else you got to get for this? Do you want to go set up real quick? Are you going to measure your seat, right? Are you, it's already up? No, nope. oh. I just put air in it, that's all. I'm gonna get, did you put air in mine? I put air in your front rear one. Now we'll go into the front one. Dun, 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 dun. Mm -hmm. Daddy, what? Guys, you got to shoot. What? Let's see if I'm all right. Dun, 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 dun. Dun 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 you grew, had to grow at least an inch over the winter, don't you think? Yeah, Try and see what you think. Not bad, eh? Maybe we should go up in a little higher? bit more. You got you any grips on there? I got those. You're the man. No I think a little higher. What do you think? A little higher in it? Oh, uh, what's he think? How you, you like your, you like your knees? You know, a, bike, a, bike like, a bike like this, a lot of the time they're oh. doing tricks and stuff. They're not, you know, not oh, even okay. really sitting on it. But I mean, I'll put it up if oh, you want to go. And try it there and see what you And next weekend, if you want to come by, you can come by and we'll do it again. I don't care. That's all good by me, man. Grips are going on, baby. 
Yeah, what else we got? That's it so far. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Nothing like a nice surface connector grip. Oh yeah. Huh? Get surface. Touching the surface. Ride the surface. What are we ride? What are we eating? Uh, Tadinos. Oh okay. Cool. Bart, do you want it? What do you want for I want it all. Chicken okay. cutlet farm. Buffalo slices? No, I'll just have regular pizza. Really? Yeah. Alright. Regular good old American pizza. About two or three slices. Right. How many what are you what are you getting? Um, what is, Marco, you what are you getting? He's getting buffalo. Freddie, what are you getting? Mm-hmm. Freddie mm-hmm. What's that? You're not eating pizza, Fred? Oh, what's the matter, Fred? No more pizza for you? Uh, to be the oh, Frederick. That's what they told you, didn't they? They told me that a long time ago, and I never listened to them. Yeah. Well, now? Now I think I'm the most have to listen to them. Oh, we're getting a little indigestion from that dairy product there? Yeah. Fucking cheese. Cheese. Right. Not good for your... Fat. Nothing but good for your calories. I'd rather eat just a greasy hamburger. <laughs> That's fine. Nice. Oh yeah. Surely. Five years old. You said the kid was right. Yeah. Five. Yeah. Two buffalo chicken slices. Is the child riding two wheels yet? And if yeah, he does. He rides two wheels? Yeah. Without training wheels, right? Yeah. So listen, where's yeah. that thing goes? 230. Yeah, I'm going to buy that today. Oh, I understand, but I'm going to show I'm it to you, man. No, we borrowed one of these one time. Let's All right, so then put it back up. You don't want to see it sure. down? Mitch. I got it half down already. What's your first name, Dad? Louis. Louis. Hey, What's that? Of course it's not. Nice. We don't sell junk around here. Yeah, no, we borrowed one of these uh, last year. It was actually pretty good. What happens is it just sits yeah, yeah, on your yeah, bike and it comes up so yeah. that way you don't have to have it on yeah. all the time. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah. It's uh, nice. Works great. They work I awesome. In the back. I bought a big cat bike two years ago. Oh, yeah? So that, thing, that thing's good in the back of that. Huh? Uh, <laughs> an electric bike? Yeah. 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 It does, you know, f- 15 to 20 miles an hour. Yeah. yeah. I, I have one of it, yeah. Well... I don't know. Yeah, it would, <laughs> you know, it's less for you, I guess. But I, I uh, you know, You're you got to be sport. careful, man. Yeah. You know, your five-year-old should be riding alongside with you. He's ready. He's ready, so. Absolutely. He, he, this is, you're almost getting, you're only going to get about a year or two out of this thing. So. You know what I mean? You know what? I would much rather see you invest in a decent bicycle for that five-year-old. Back here with Rocco then. And then do, and then, and then have him riding alongside of you. Have, it's more, see about, it's more see about him not listening in the street. That's what I'm here out here. That's him not listening in the street? I mean, these guys are good, but I don't want, you know, these are a little well, narrow ridge right here. That's all. Oh, yeah, it's narrow, and, you know, they should lead. You should be no, in the no, back, lead, right? With the two guys I control, the third guy, it's a little uh, scarier, so. Well, you know, it's, uh, I, 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 I hear you, man. I mean, well, if he wants to come and he wants to go on rides, which I would assume he wants to be just like his big brothers, I would assume that maybe he might listen up, but then again, maybe he won't. I don't know, you know. As my father said, my hand itches when I didn't listen, you know what I mean? But I don't think you're allowed to do that kind of thing anymore. I, I don't quite Why? Um, because, you know, I've been... Huh? Those bank loans are good place? Yeah. It's not, it, it's, it's, not, it's not a question that we're looking to, to... We're just looking to get your attention, that's all. Um, all right. So there you have it, gentlemen. Okay, go look for one. Alright. Are you going to carry this home now? Okay. Okay. You want to find it? That's the new color, too, huh? Yep. It's the new blue. It's so nice. It's a nice dark midnight blue. I, I like it. I think it's better than the other color of blue. That, that sky blue.
I love how the fans are always looking out for us too. Thank you guys. Yeah, that's always appreciated. I had uh, questions about my veins on the side of my leg and how I should have them checked out. And my doctor says, don't worry about it. If it hurts, then we should worry about it. But for now, don't worry about it. The other thing he said about my varicose veins on my legs, <laughs> you, you really don't want to be wearing them stockings, do you, Bart? And I says, no, I don't. So sooner or later, I guess compression stockings are in my your future. Your future. But sucks getting old. It's all about being on your feet for 85 million years. That's why my veins are sticking out of my legs. I mean, it's... Well... <laughs> High blood pressure. High blood pressure. And actually, my blood pressure's been really good lately, so I can't... Uh, been right on the money. Yeah. I got, uh, I know my cholesterol was eh, so I take a pill for that. I, oh, oh, I just think about it and my cholesterol goes up. Mm. Eh, you know guys, you only live once. So, what's that? Is this garbage? No. Oh. This is the tarp for the pedicab, right? Yep. Shall I do a little dance for you? That's it. Helicopter, helicopter. Bang out the helicopter. that Schwinn Airdyne, get some more lube on that chain, work that in pretty good. And, uh, oh man, maybe we should get, hit the dump. Let's get rid of some of this cardboard. Maybe we could hit North Sea. I'm thinking about all the different stuff we could do here today, this afternoon. I'll keep you on new bikes, get them done. Build, the new Build these new bikes, get these done out of here, and then we got some upstairs. Uh, Brooklyn's were good, right? We got everything, all color swatches, all sizes, everything's good on Brooklyn, right? Yep. Okay. Still looking for my eyeglasses. Ugh. All right. I guess that's going to cover it, man. I don't know. I got nothing else. You got anything else to cover? Got I got nothing. I got nothing. I'm sorry, guys, it wasn't really happening today, but I'm so happy that we got ourselves back up and running. That was a big one. Um, I was really, really concerned. Uh, so, again, I thank all of you guys for tuning in today. We had a great day. We had a good show. I thought it was awesome. If you're not familiar with who we are, we do have the Instagram, our Facebook, and our Twitter. Uh, check us out. Uh, come on over. You can keep up to the date with all of the latest stuff that the Bike Man for You and crew are doing. Uh, again, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and of course, our YouTube. You guys could also help us out by sharing it. Please share it amongst all your friends and anybody else that you know and pump it out there and help us out to spread the word. The retail environment is extremely difficult and tough right now, but you know what? We're doing what we can. I want all you guys to have fun. Today's show, presented by... Cali Protectives. Cali Protective Safety takes no holiday. Chop, chop, wear your helmet. 
So today's show is sponsored by Surface, Surface Tires. We had a little show there. We showed you about Surface Tires. Surface Tires are awesome. EVT Safe Zone Mirror, the helmet mirror. You always want to go over and check that out over at bikemanforyou.com. Guys, I want everybody to have fun. Let's just go around and BMX boy, good job. Freddy, good job. Let's go around and say goodbye to everybody. Say hello. Say goodbye. I'm going to come back out and all you guys can start saying goodbye to one another like you always do. TJP is in the house. We're signing off the air. Baby G, good job today. Look up there and say hello to everybody up there. Nothing? <laughs> Um, those are for the sand. You, you had it last year. In fact, you know what? Bro, I have one ever. You know what? We had a yeah, son of in the house. Son of a good job again today. Really, really awesome with figuring all of that yeah, out. Nice. Nice. What else do you got? I just had grips. That's all on my end. That was all my end. Grips. So, uh, though they're getting the wiggle chest stuff. Oh, I wonder if... Other than that, I got nothing else for you guys. I hope you guys had fun today. We sure did. We, I am so happy that everything has worked out. It just makes things so much better on my mind. Less stress. It's cool. I want everybody to be kind to one another. I want everybody to treat everyone with respect. You don't have to like them, but you just got to respect them. Please. It'll help us all out in the long run. If you see something, guys, say something. The war on terror never, never ends. Surface connectors, I want to say 20 bucks. They're written up there. They're on the package. I think. I'm not sure. I'm going to tell you in a half a second. How much? Well, let's go take a look and see exactly what they are. Oh, I can't get there from here. 1995, the small ones. Couldn't they see? Couldn't they see I was in the middle of? Dude, couldn't they see that I was in the middle of signing off? I mean, come on, huh? What's the problem? <laughs> if you see something, guys, say something. The war on terror is never ending. Thoughts are going out to the people of the UK. You guys are uh, you guys are getting it beat up pretty good lately with that whole thing, and uh, I know the feeling. Okay, um, stay the course. We're all good. Love all you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. Guys, enjoy, have fun, stay safe, and of course, never fear, the bike man for you is here. Dun, 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 dun. See ya.